Hello and welcome everyone, it's Friday, we've made it through another week, yay. In other news, we got a great show for you tonight. Our special guest joining us is Shy Lily, the stinkiest. We got some Genshin, new character available, and you can bet there's gonna be some rolling for that. Yes. Small chance of some dead space after, but don't count on it. And to cap things off a special performance, where we take RD and send some pings live, right here in the studio cheer 1000. <laughs> Let's go! Welcome! E -e -e -e. Hello, Tzad. How you do? My friend! Thank you for the survey! We have a meeting? Hmm? What meeting? No dead space afterwards? We have- what? Oh, you mean- oh, streaming! Oh, right, 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 right. We do have a meeting. I, I didn't say dead space after the fuck? Oh, oh, you mean- oh, you mean Sith. Oh, oh, okay. But I was still in the title. I was like- I was like, Sith still said dead space in the title. Ain't no way. Whoa, wait! I'm Clipper HC's viewer and my follow and sub and bits. Okay. Holy shit. Thank you, Korean friend. Black. Black cow, Korea. Thank you so much. It's fuck. Hello? Hello Lily. Hope you are doing good today. Yes. Also, bits still 1k. Oh, right, 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 right. I thought people were just being generous. <laughs> <laughs> oh sorry wait 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 it takes two seconds to fix i haven't bookmarked it's literally okay done perfect i tried to remind you yesterday it's all yesterday okay i saw it yesterday but i was like yeah uh so fucking oh oh my god it's five jesus one one zero less jesus <laughs> Where's generosity? Okay, now it's 500. Fuck! I, I wasn't. I was. I was. I was bashing. Um, I, it's because. Okay, I. Korean uh, friend donated 5k, and then for some reason the 5k looked correct in my eyes. <laughs> Holy shit! Thank you for the 5,000, my Korean friend. Holy shit! I don't know what to say. I have, yes, Seth. Thank you so much. Uh, Amalfrey, thank you. Cosly, thank you. Madu, thank you. Bino, thank you. Nox, thank you. Uh, Fida, well, Fida, thank you so much. Uh, Anubis, thank you so much. Ram, thank you. Cherry, thank you. Gamer, Kuro, Jack, Gaming, Zed, Space, thank you so much. Hi! <laughs> Hi! Oh, wait, um. Hi! I need to change the reset message. Oh fuck! I'm I'm so sorry. Mm. Subscriptions, subscription, reset, TTS, enable. <laughs> okay, fuck, Messina. How you do? Thank you so much. And it's at the potential for dead space. Oh yeah, I did say yesterday, but uh, I do indeed hey, have a stinky. meeting. Hope at the your stream. tummy feels better today, shy Pepla. It does, Uncle Siddle. Thank you. <laughs> it does. It does. I. It does a lot. Um. Yeah. Wait. Let me ask something real quick, cause um. Your call was heard. The horde is here. Womp womp. Okay, oh, okay, I also have, um, I have some bad news, though! I, okay, I can talk about it. I have some bad news, most likely. Um, let me have a quick look. Mm. 13 monthies. Show us Cave Spider Lily Plaza. It is adorable and small and toxic. Okay, yeah, I can talk about it. I am mesmerized by the shrimp on your tail. He's cute! Stop staring at him. 
<laughs> He's adorable. Wheel, 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 wheel. I love him. He is so nice. Oh yeah, the unannounced Emirates. My bad. I, am I supposed to announce it <laughs> every time it happens? <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, yeah, we we've had some unannounced emerging. Uh, please forgive me. We are uh, i feeling a little rowdy today. You know, <laughs> feeling a little wild. Thank you so much for the subby. Um, Shike, thank you. Uh. Uh, Denizen, thank you so much. Let me see if I can find the other ones. Yeverlings, thank you, thank you. Holy! No, no, mind, that was Biddy's. Architect, Karma, thank you, thank you. Alex, thank you. Captain, thank you. Space Cowboy, thank you. Zip, thank you. Gaming with Nomad, thank you. Jack, Kurori, uh, Mask, Cherry, Ram, thank you so much. Uh, that should be all. So, yeah, I've got some bad news! Yesterday, I was very close to having some good news, but today I have bad news. Oh yeah, let me do the pinks first. You're, you're, you are correct, as always, chat. You're always so right. You're always correct. Uh, send. Let me do the pinks. Good afternoon! <laughs> Thank you, Sino. Uh, Twitter ping is out. I'm just gonna do Discord real quick. Quick, Lily. Yeah. Why can't a nose be 12 inches? Because then it would uh. be a foot. Oh my fuck. Stop. Stop. Such. Oh my god. The American jokes. <laughs> and I say Germans ain't funny. <laughs> what? <laughs> stop. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Nico Alpha, thank you. Um, yes, I have some uh, unfortunate bad news for you guys. Uh, are you ready? Yesterday it was supposed to be amazing news, probably the best news I've had in a long time. But um, today everything turned 180 when um, bureaucracy is ruining everything. I was supposed to be in Texas next month. I was, yeah, I was, I was, Gigi Subs tried to fly me out to Texas to VeepCon and I was gonna stay at the Hotel Gaylord. Everything would have been first class. They would have taken yeah. me out for dinner. They would have organized everything. One, one, seven, it one, is amazing! Seven. However, we ain't got a passport. <laughs> And then we had hope because we found out that um, you can get emergency Shy passports eyes. that are temporary. They're very expensive and they only last about a year, I think. Half a year, a year. But would have been enough, you know? Womp like, womp. yes. But apparently the US is um, <laughs> the country of freedom. Free to not go because you... The U.S. is the only country that doesn't accept the emergency passports because the U.S. insists that the passport has a chip, which the usual passports do, but the emergency one doesn't. So, yes. And the reason we don't have a passport is because we are European. Um, the, the, the land of the truly free, we, we, don't, we don't need a passport to travel around. We, we, we have an ID card. <laughs> We, we whip out our wallet and show off our ID card and we're good to go. We can go everywhere the fuck we want. We just have an ID card. So, what? Womp Cow? Womp forever. What? Um, huh? Good for second bits. Why? Jesus! Thank you! <laughs> but I don't... Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! That is insane. Nico, thank you so much. So, yeah. Oh yeah, if you're British, you probably have a passport nowadays because you're no longer in the EU. Um, I should have just specified EU, not 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 Europe, just EU. <laughs> oh God, fucking America! What's wrong with you guys? 
a chance to be in Texas next month. Looking forward to more fun streams. Shy love, shy love. Thank you so much, Ilya. Man, that's that. That's so ass. Like Jesus Christ, that that's so ass. I don't. Yeah, I was gonna be in America. I wanted to surprise you all. I was even gonna have a cosplay as well and have a meet and greet at the VeepCon. Uh, we would have like a really cool hey. casual one as well, where it's like oh a hangout launch more than like a next. Okay, uh, I'll sign this picture by next. What is wrong with America? A lot. The answer is <laughs> a, a lot. lot. What isn't wrong? It would have been so fun to just like have a have a meet and greet lounge Hello, where we're just all like in a big group hanging out. I'll be there in cosplay and you as a <laughs> fucking America. You can't get in with an emergency passport. You can use an emergency passport everywhere Happy else in the Friday. world. This is a literally. Shy? What? What is wrong? Okay, um, thanks. This, um, ba back on topic. This is literally an American thing only. Because America insists that the passport needs to have a chip for whatever fucking reason. Like, why? And emergency passports don't come with a chip. The only reason you can go and enter the US without the chip is if you have uh, close relatives um, dying and you need to visit them or take care of them. That's the only reason you get in. It's so stupid! <laughs> oh gosh. As an American, the bureaucracy here is more whack than a stack of bananas. 100% uh, blame the crazed people in Congress. Yes, I absolutely, yes. You know what's worse than America? Uh, a singing computer. Uh, They're Adele. Oh my god, stop, stop it, stop, stop! <laughs> Speaking of security, every other country manages. Hey, yo, I'm a hit up my the boy Joe and get I don't the think airport security is America's biggest security issue, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> You guys have a, a, a lot of, um, <laughs> how does it is nicely? I don't think airport security and people coming to America is your biggest security issue there. <laughs> I don't, I think you have, you have, um, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's really not your biggest issue in your country. <laughs> um, but yeah, I can't, I can't come over. Come visit me, Lily. I'm dying. It'll work, I promise. <laughs> oh god, I, I, I hope you're not. Um, yeah, so that sucks. I was gonna be in Texas next month with you guys for a couple days. Uh, both days of VeepCon. It would have been cool to hang out, have a lunch and stuff. First class! I've never flown for multiple hours to begin with. And then all of those hours being first class, dude, I was so ready. I was, I was ready, dude. <laughs> I was ready. So, yeah. I... Ora... Uh, uh, excuse you, why? Why? Huh? Thank you for the 50! America is a silly place. Hope you get the chance again in the future, shy. I, past. I hope so too, kid. I... <laughs> I hope so too, fun! So yeah, I had the, the America trip has unfortunately had to- What the fuck is wrong? Had to unfortunately be cancelled. That was, um... Yeah, boy, is that- that sucks. <laughs> that was really shitty! I hate it. So yeah, that would have been my first time in America! And it would have been stress free because GG subs organizes everything for me. Everything. I sick coughing and sniffing with high fever. Could I have a sympathetic womp womp? Womp womp! I'm begging and shameless. Heart. <laughs> womp womp, thank you so much. It's a weak reason, too, for real. It is. Um, And the actual proper passport. Uh. Unfortunately, it takes longer than... Like, it takes too long, because... 
we're not gonna get an appointment until next month when the con is already there and it will take another month to get the passport so yeah it will it'll, it'll take minimum two months which is kinda yikes that that's so dumb what a process dude what a process that's so stupid i was so excited let me close the window but not close the window but like shut the blades close the blades It's so dumb. Oh well. So yeah, yesterday I was excited. Where's my foot rest? <sighs> yesterday I was excited to let you guys know I'll be in Texas. And today my hopes and dreams got shattered. When I found out the passports were expired. I have a passport, but it's expired. Uh, didn't know, cause I don't really need a passport to travel around. I'm, I'm European. <laughs> My passport is good for a couple more years. Yeah, fuck, man. Womp, womp, please. Womp, womp. And lovely as usual. <laughs> Holy shit, another 10k. What it? What is wrong with you? Holy Jesus. Fuck, thank you. Last one, I promise, Tilda. Why don't yeah. you see dinosaurs wearing top hats? Because they're extinct. Stop, stop. Yeah, this should this should be your last one because they're trash. They're bad. I survived the most dangerous <sighs> place in America. And all I got was this lousy diploma. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I, I give you that one. That one is funny. I yes. <laughs> I yeah, that okay, fine. <laughs> Time for some dad joke tax? Yes, dad joke tax. Every time you do a dad joke, you have to pay the dad joke tax. Hi, Devil Shirley. boy. Hi. Ten wonderful months with the stink Yorker. <laughs> Thank Plus, you. Today's my birthday. Oh, happy Can birthday. birthday Hi again. Wow. <laughs> Oh my god, Risley, thank you. Happy birthday. But yeah, so um, that's such. Whatever con is going to happen after, I'll be there, of course. Um, If Gigi decides to fly me out to another con, which they already said they will. So whatever other con will is, is going to happen this year that GG subs attends I'll probably be there as well with GG having like a meet and greet and stuff but <sighs> it's exciting yes the only thing that you have to Pierre is Pierre itself <laughs> yes but it would have been Flash. so nice to go to the one in taxes also because uh, a lot of my friends are going so it's not just me wanting to go but there's so many friends of mine going too Devil what? Oh shit! I uh, thank you for the ten gifted subbies. Holy shit! Thank you, thank you. Hi. Hi. Lily. I'm back after watching the Honey Churros video. <laughs> I will come to see you often. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> there is nothing built in America anymore. I just built? bought a brand new TV and it said built in antenna. I don't even know where the fuck that is. <laughs> okay, okay, you know what? Fine, that one was funny. Okay, I morning, I get it. that one Hi. funny. I get it. <laughs> Good morning, Tyan. <laughs> Thank you for the tier three. Oh shit! Speaking of tier three, I think I missed one earlier, didn't I? I remember talking about uh the taxes thing. And I think I missed a tier 3. I wanted to get back later. Yeah, go to Ken! There it was! The 9 month tier 3. Roses are red, violets are blue. Why is Orca so small and so hecking cute too? I'm not small. You know what? There's nothing wrong with being Rainbow small. Rainbow shrimp, let's go. It comes with dis disadvantages like literally paying for a rented space that I don't even use half the time because I can't reach half my fucking kitchen stuff. Be 
because everything is too high and I'm constantly having to go through the pain of setting up stupid fucking little step ladders everywhere to reach my everyday items. But just tell security you're an orca volunteering to entertain at Sea World. <laughs> yes. Long. But it comes with advantages too, like. It just, it just does. It's an, I'm compact. It, it, it comes, <laughs> stop, not the pause, stop. It comes with advantages too, I swear. I can sm fit small spaces. There ain't none to fit into, but if there were, I could. Less expensive baths. Yes, yes, I can fit into sports cars, even though I would never own one. Y yeah. See? Do you want to hear a pizza joke? Do I? Never mind, it's too cheesy. Stop. American pizza be like. <laughs> Thank you, Scorpio. What American junk food would you like to have? Mm. I'm gonna be honest, just all your junk food. I. Yeah, just just all your junk. I wanna try your junk food in then general. Then fit into someone's luggage keck. I, sure. Pop tarts. Oh yeah, I I like to try pop tarts. I wanna. Jesus, why? Break out! I've been trying to watch the stream since I first saw it on Honey Cheerios clip, <laughs> but it's too late. But Charlie but... is the cutest one. Are you sure? <laughs> Oh my goodness, Black Cow, thank one, one you. Well, well. As well. That's because I never knew my real ladder. Oh my stuff. Jesus, Black Cow, thank you so much for 5,000. Love the between you and Geary, but Geary was more stinky than you. I, I wouldn't say so. I, I'm literally on day six of not washing my hair. I don't, I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm on, yeah. <laughs> My face looks amazing, by the way. This this is this is super off topic, but um, uh, I've been dealing with some breakouts for a while, and I have no idea why. But Gary is on day six of not washing at all. <laughs> but lately, my face is just wow. It's baby skin. I'm so happy. Mikoto, thank you for the prime, dude. I. I don't know where the fuck that breakout came from for no fucking reason. I don't know what the fuck was in the air, but my 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 skin is amazing again. I'm so happy. I've I've got the baby skin again. I it's so moisturized, not flaky. It's it's so smooth and and I just it shines. It's like vibrant. Stress? It it, it could be. I, yeah, it's a possibility. So, we're ah. doing dad jokes now? No, right. stop! Let's see if you're a sharp one. Life without music would be flat. Just be natural, and everything will happen as directed. Should I continue? Kind of in no. full swing now. No, 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 don't, do not, d no. No, stop. Stop. Womp womp. Kappa, thank you. Something <laughs> so is different like, thank about you, you Munkerham. Did you change the tracking of your model? You look more lively. Ah. Anyways, much love. You are amazing. And I hope your 2023 will be the best year of your life. Shy I did. Happy. I, I mean, I have two different models, right? Like, I have I have two trackings. So, I have I have the standard tracking, which is this one. It's the standard one. Nothing special about this tracking. It's... It's literally just a standard tracking. I'll, this is what pretty much all VTubers come with, except I match the parameters to myself, basically. So this is this is the default tracking I like the most because it looks the most natural, to be honest. But um, then after the this is the base, right? This is the base. But we also have, boom, the reverse tracking. Uh, in this one, I can't really lean to the sides a whole lot, but it looks more human, I suppose. 
but Shiraimo also kind of sassy. It's, 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 it's got the sass. This, this checking type, it's got sassiness. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it feels very different. It's very, very, very different tracking types. Yeah, yeah. The sass Three men check. walk into a bar. You'd think after the first one, the other two would have learned to duck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> nice tracking. Yeah, yeah. How Nine chunky my arms are! What, what, what do you mean chunky? Those are just there, not how... What? Fatty? How the... Huh? Y'all seen arms? How are these arms chunky? I don't, don't gas like Happy me. Those arms months, ain't chunky. Womp womp. Nah, I'm sorry. I ain't got any ant arms. I ain't... I ain't a fucking buggy with stick arms. I ain't no stick buggy. I don't have mantis sticks. They're... They're... They're, they're normal arms. <laughs> they're literally... There's nothing wrong with these arms. What? <laughs> I... <laughs> Lily is a chunky orchid. It explains the constant <laughs> gas. All orchids are gassy, yes. I... Chat. Chat. Okay, listen. Since I know Look. you love nuggets. Whenever you visit the US, make it a mission to try Chick fil A nuggets. <gasps> Maybe the even nuggets! More a reaction for us. Yes. I'll, 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 I'll love to try. I want to try a bunch of stuff. Okay, chat. Look. 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 I don't know. I don't know what the fuck kind of arms you guys have, but. the These arms. Let me go to the side a little bit. Hey, Lily. Sorry for the random question, but yes. I was wondering. Mm -hmm. What do you think of people that fap on you? <laughs> I don't give a shit, man! I've masturbated to myself! I, you do you! I don't know what the fuck you're up to in your free time in my fucking business! <laughs> you do you! <laughs> what are you. <laughs> nah, but I swear. The fucking, the fucking neck pause champ with the microphone. It gets me every time. Stop. <laughs> I don't know what this. I don't. Whatever the fuck you do in your free time, I don't. You. I don't give a shit. Hey, Stop. Lily, did you hear about the slaw bunnies being updated into Dead Space? The slash slaw bunnies nuts. Oh my fucking god! You guys. Okay, listen. Look at my arms. Look at my arms. All right, all right. Look at these arms. And now look. And now look at an actual human. An actual human. You see these arms right there? Well, you see, Lily, the problem is they're all nerds who can't lift more they're than the same arm. Their spaghetti. The only arms they've seen are their own that look like the noodles they're eating with said <laughs> fork. They do. You know, ever since you can do the puss in boot size, you've got lethal levels of cute. I do? Wee wee? Wee wee? They say self love is important, but what blink? <laughs> but what? Listen, look at my arms. Look at the arms in the picture. They're literally the same my arm. My said I'm a beat the meat, but first got to get that consent. You know what? I respect that shrimp for bravery and mannerism. <laughs> yes, I d yes. <laughs> not the voice. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Not not the voice. <laughs> the one on the left is more anime though. I How's the left arm more anime? What? <laughs> I'm not an anime. <laughs> I how are they? All I can no. see is the mod cage in the top right corner. The mod, mod cage. <laughs> the mod cage. 
I listen. It's literally it's the same arm. I don't know if you've ever She's seen. She's causally holding a freaking baby orca whale. <laughs> Those weigh anywhere between three to four hundred pounds. Yes. She's likely stronger than any of us. That feel is basically spoiled. Lily's cute face is a danger to all sentient life. I mean, look at it. Totally could wipe us all out. Wee wee. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sandetsu. <laughs> For the tier 3 summary! I've seen it, I've seen it. Chat uh, made it very difficult to miss. Yes, yes. Muscle mummy? I <laughs> if you think those noodle arms are muscular, I've got bad news for you. I've, I've got, I've got exceptional, I've hey, got Lily, very bad news for you. Tax. <laughs> Why didn't the toilet paper cross the road? Because it got stuck in a crack. Lol heck. Why are you like this? Why? <laughs> Muscle queen, ladies, I wish, but no, I am a, I have the strength of a fucking stick. Elliot, thank you. Why, Jesus? Thank you, wanker queen. <laughs> I'm a noodle queen. Elliot, holy shit, thank you for the gift there. Yeah, we we a noodle queen, chat. We a noodle queen. Stonks, shy bop. Stonks, stonks. Yes, yes. You can make houses out of sticks. <laughs> yes. Yeah, if you think those arms are muscular, what the fuck is is buff pop? I is she just is she the rock of VTubers? She is she is just the the VTuber rock. Shadow, thank you for the prime. Baba's dad. <laughs> Baba? Baba? It's been a year, daddy. <laughs> when the sock under your bed starts talking to you. We, it's I been a year, looks. daddy. Carry on. Nothing to I see miss here. You. I hope you get cuddles. <laughs> Oh my god, thank you so much. Cuddle, yes. Shy love, shy love. Mm -mm. I love the emotes so much. I can't without them anymore. I'm calling Jesus on y'all! <laughs> that adorable face deserves some opals. Oh. Oops. Oh. And yeah, I'm stealing that from Sith Keck. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Lily, question mark? What American thing yes? are you excited to try out? Dude, okay, so I just wanna try your fast food. I, I wanna, I wanna just try out fast food. What has four wheels and flies? A garbage truck. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Please. No, you don't. I do. Okay, so the reason I want to try American fast food, McDonald's. Burger King, just some random ass place that serves fries and burgers and other shit. I wanna try them because every time I say I ate at McDonald's or I had something at a fast food chain, Americans bash on me because they're like, oh my, if you eat at McDonald's, you might as well eat plastic or cardboard. And I'm like, it's really not any bad whatsoever. In fact, they're fucking uh, chicken, burrito, and and brickies and salads, they're fucking buzzing, dude. They're buzzing. So I wanna go to America to see why the fuck you're all shitting on me for eating McDonald's and Burger King or any fast food, literally any fast food. I wanna know what the fuck is wrong with American food cause clearly everyone hates it. I have a fear of elevators. I am taking steps to avoid them. Stop, stop, stop it! the dad jokes <laughs> oh yeah kfc as well and, and everything food standards shiny, are worse in the us graph. the euro versions ah chat so fast fuck the euro Congrats versions on being are much nominated. healthier also, i don't know about healthier I agree with you on eating maybe when you're hungry <laughs> and when you do slap your belly and answer the call I can confirm, McDonald's in Europe is much better than it is in America. Yeah, they are! They use real meat in the EU. The fuck do you use in your McDonald's? 
If it ain't... There is unreal meat? The fuck is unreal meat? A cardboard? What? A mattress stuffing? Nah, for... Okay, like, stop gaslighting me. What the fuck do you use? In your burgies? Soylent Green. What the fuck is Soylent Green? What is fake meat? Are they all... Vegan? Cardboard. Yep. Jeez. Huh? Bear Otter. Thank you for the half a year tier 3. Jumping on the joke train slash what did one toilet say to another? Slash you look flushed. I hate you. Stop. <laughs> Not even vegans would eat that shit. I can say that American fast food like McDonald's and other larger chains have more processed foods which drain the quality and flavor compared to the same chains in Europe. I enjoyed Burger uh, King whenever I went to the UK a few years ago, really? but that same stuff was utter sewer trash here. Gosh, maybe I don't want to try it. <laughs> Y'all either exaggerating big time, cause as much as non-Americans like to shit on America, I found out that Americans specifically love to shit on America. So you all either gaslight me and exaggerate, or it is literally sewage. <laughs> Five guys is better breakers. I Y'all I'm I don't I am I, I like to live mono mono in, in monogamy. Thank you. <laughs> I don't think I like five guys. I one is enough. Thanks. I'm I'm happy with just the one I I, I wouldn't I don't know about five I if I if I were to ever maybe just two and I don't think the plus one would be a guy. I, it'll probably just be another lady. I'm gonna be honest. You all need to come to Europe to enjoy some real food. <laughs> I, Numi always says American food is great. She doesn't like eel food. I was like, I get it. Trust E. Lily. I wish I was shitting on you <laughs> here. I refuse to eat at McDonald's really? since there are far better burger places around. Sheesh, man. Nobody just loves sugar. She probably does. The problem arises with the fact that most of those fast food chains in America are independently owned, meaning oh. that no two McDonald's are the same. Really? So chances are the ones shitting about it are shitting on their own restaurant. That's fucked up. Wait, how does this work? When we have a chain here like McDonald's, it's the same McDonald's throughout the entirety of the Netherlands. Same menu, same flavoring, same ingredients in your chicken burritos. Oh, wraps, they're wraps, sorry, I'm burritos, they're, they're, they're wraps, chicken wraps. Honey mustard chicken wrap. Like, that's so weird. Cheering for you because you are awesome and you deserve it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Holy shit. <laughs> Lily, don't listen to these babies. Just follow Asman's advice. The man uh, knows his fast food better than anyone else. <laughs> he won't lead you astray. I'll just ask Asman what fast food Perhaps I should have. Perhaps it's a slight exaggeration, but definitely avoid McDonald's, Burger King, and Arby's if you have the option to. I suggest Whataburger and Chick fil A, though. Both are just fantastic. You guys scare me. Also, I just saw someone in chat telling me to stop supporting soulless corporations out of convenience. I'm sorry, but I am not burning One three point. times the fuel to go to a restaurant where the meal takes two hours for me to go in, order, eat, and pay, and drop 35 bucks when I can just go to McDonald's on my way home and have a fucking chicken wrap. I don't... <laughs> I don't care about convenience. 16 months of beautiful, I'm sorry, but it's, it's literally the, the whole point. Convenience is literally the whole point. I ain't gonna go on a on a 40 minute ride in a car to burn three times the fuel to go to a restaurant that takes three times my time out of my day, bro. I'm sorry, but I ain't gonna adjust just because fast food is everywhere. Womp womp, hello womp in womp. Texas Roadhouse, they serve fresh bread from the oven with butter on top of it. 
Oh, buddy. Keck, did someone with a Twitch account just say to stop supporting a soulless corporation? <laughs> I didn't even think about that. <laughs> That's a good point. I <laughs> oh, sorry, we are rebranding to kick. My bad. <laughs> oh gosh, those people saying to not support corporations don't understand that the reason those corporations are so big is because the products and services they provide are obviously in high demand. Yes, I. I'm sorry, but clearly those are the words of a person that conveniently enough is out of reach out of most big corporations and has locally sourced things locally available i do not is there any specific place you want to visit in america mm. not america vegas i think i think vegas would be cool to visit if you ever come to Missouri, see about going bad. to a place called Lambert's, home of the Lambert's. Code Rolls. Only like two stores, but it's <laughs> Black freaking good food. No. Alt, if I go to America, you'll you have to- It's called franchising. Basically, people buy a restaurant from the main company and own it themselves. Really? With their own management and their own way of doing the stuff. That's so weird. But there are a few fast food chains that keep it the same. Like in and out White Castle, Krispy Kreme, and Krispy such. Krispy Kreme! Krispy Kreme. Yeah, I'm not because I want to gamble in Vegas, but I just want to see what the fuck it's like to be in a town that never sleeps. Like, what is it like to just, like, walk down the streets in the middle of the night? In company, of course. I would never... I'm so sorry. But, but in America, I... You guys make it sound like a horrible place. I, I would never walk alone anywhere. I'm European. I can go outside at 2 a.m. in the fucking forest and I'm cool. But from other horror stories I hear from you guys, I would never, not even in the middle of the city, walk alone. Ever. I'd, no. In, in company. I, I'll have Busca with me, Numi with me, Bal with me. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, absolutely. I think Saikuna is going to Vegas too. I, I would not be alone. No, no, Just no, no, no. come visit Seattle. Seattle? We can get a bag of dicks. Yes! I, I will love dicks! <laughs> yes! The best fast robot. food burger I've no? ever had is from a place called All American Drive In. Mm. It's near where I used to live in New York. It's hands down my favorite place to go whenever I go back to visit friends. Cute. I'm saying this because even though I doubt there will ever be a convenient chance for you to eat there, but if it was ever a possibility, I'd say it's a must have cheer I mean, it's just a matter of when I'll go to America. Not Kick if, uses the when. same back end which uses, offered by Amazon, reality <laughs> is, if you want to it was a joke, a visual. cooperation, <laughs> only way is to go to a mountain that is not owned and become a goat. <laughs> On the bright side, at least she isn't going to Florida. Wait, is it? Is that a bad place? Like, okay, I'm not sure if that's a good thing. Uh, Blue just said that Vegas looks better at night compared to what it looks like in the day. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it's the worst. Fuck. What's wrong with Florida? What happens there? The fuck's going on in Florida? You will not survive in Florida? Fuck, you, you're scaring me. You're scaring me. Florida, man, happens in Florida. <laughs> it's the gooch of the country. Ah! Too many old and crazy people there? Oh, fuck. Nah, 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 nah. In the way! <laughs> cool nature, terrible people. <laughs> Alright. Got it. Staying away from Florida. Okay, Jesus Christ. Alright. We're not, we're not going drugs. Alright, cool. Alright, got it. Not going to Florida. Okay. <laughs> Alligators in my backyard! I, I feel like that is... Uh, Loki, not the biggest thing to fear in Florida. Fuck, that is, yeah. 
No me, wait, no me in from Florida, see? Sí. Nah. just search Florida man on Google or YouTube. Endless, <laughs> Endless entertainment. entertainment. <laughs> Florida man got arrested twice for knocking at an alligator. Twice? The fuck? Marcus, what's up? But thank you for the 1,000 videos. Nah, in the way, the fuck? Florida is. Is? Florida. Search Florida man and watch out for the ultra conservatives trying to outlaw anything not white and radically Christian. Jesus also Christ. Also lots of meth there. Oh, oh great, meth too, yeah. Lovely. Womp womp. Womp womp, thank you, it's okay. I have a bad joke about paper. No. But it's terrible. Stop. Stop, no, stop. No, no more dad jokes. Seize. Don't you know? Seas. Every country in the world belongs to America. <laughs> Guess I'm American, boys. That means I can travel. Let's go. I'm, I'm an, I'm an Thank American. Thank you for I'm holding good. me. <laughs> Thank you. I've lived in Florida since the 90s. I uh -huh. can honestly say it's a great place. Yes. Sure, there's places to avoid, but you can say oh, that's oh, about absolutely, any place. Absolutely. Yeah, 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 yeah. I that have is no dad joke. I, I don't believe that there womp, exists womp, shy, a bop. single country where if you go to a very specific shady fucked up area you're not quite literally sort of endangering yourself. I think that applies to every every single country. There's always that one spot even if it's just like two streets in the whole country that's just like you should never go there. That's not where anyone belongs. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure every country has that, but it depends on how many places there are, like the percentage. Like in the Netherlands, I'm pretty sure there is places like that too. Probably Amsterdam to be honest, but Compared to like the large percentage and crime rates of like the entire country, it's literally nothing. I think it, it depends largely on just like percentage in each region. If you want to determine how truly dangerous a place is. And then you need to make sure that you just stay away wherever the crime rates are the by far highest in whatever place you're at. Yeah. My guess. Florida man facing charges for allegedly attacking shark with hammer at Brevard Beach. Okay, um... Context aside... How does a shark sue a man? Does he just... At the, the shark just goes like, Oh, yes, fool, and the man self-defense? And, and, and then... And then gets bonged with a hammer and then a shark just goes like, Oh no! And, and, and he sues the dude. Animal violence? The shark started him! Ill self-defense! I mean, I'm guessing. I, it's probably... I mean, like, don't worry about it. <laughs> Emotional damage. The McDonald's in Hawaii literally serves steamed rice its way different from the rest of the US. Yeah, um, yeah. For sure. Yes. You can catch and eat shark. Akura started it! They don't usually go after people. Okay, they don't usually, but the they do. just wanted to know if he had games on his phone. Yes. So are you telling me just because sharks don't usually attack people that if a shark were to attack me in, in the scenario where there's a small chance the shark does, I can't defend myself. I'll just be like, oh no, well, that's that's unfortunate. Guess I'll have him rip off my leg because the shark is gonna sue me if I fight back. Can't bonk him with whatever equipment I have ready. <laughs> like, what? I've heard McDonald's slept so much harder in countries outside the US. Allegedly, it does. I wouldn't know because I don't live in the US. I only know EU standards, but just rotate it. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Can you be egg lily? She, uh, black cow. What is wrong with you, Michael and friend? You are your finance. You, Jesus. <laughs> Fuck. Seven months, womp womp. 
Sauce, thank you so much. Wayne, thank you. I uh, I can. I don't know what you're talking about, but um. Uh, I don't have a bolt toggle. I. <laughs> I'm just uh. A little shiny around the edges sometimes. <laughs> Actually, it's illegal to illegal to feed, harass, harm, pursue, hunt, shoot, wound, kill, annoy, or molest manatees. Molest. Because they are very curious. M mo molest manatees. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> Thank you so much. Sometimes I'm afraid that um, Korean friends only think that. I'm cute because they don't know all of the cursed things I talk about. <laughs> Why shouldn't you write with a broken pencil? Stop. Because it's just Stop. pointless. Stop it! Stop. Why are you the way you are? I mean, I expect everything after I heard that someone sued Red Bull for not giving him wings while drinking. <laughs> oh won. God. Okay. I Gosh, no, I I can't believe that's an actual thing. I this it just hurts. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't want to know why the fuck molest is on the list of um harm. Manatee harm. I I don't I don't I don't know, man. That <laughs> I don't want to know why that's on the list of things you shouldn't do to a manatee. Well, it's illegal. You see, half the reason it's illegal is because people used to do it and then other people were like, no, that's wrong, and then they make laws against it. So chances are, at least once or more times, someone uh, has been the reason that molest is now on the list of things to not do with a manatee. <laughs> is it because... What do- how do you- do you just like, whip it out? And like, you, 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 you're just laying it there and you wait for the- that, that's so- I, I can't. <laughs> Probably, don't, don't think about it. <laughs> you know, yeah. thinking about it deeply and considering the number of dad jokes, perhaps we should turn the bit price back up. Doesn't yes, so I, I do now. agree. I'll even give you a lifetime. I, I agree. I agree. I agree. In Opens. return, Opens. it is believed that manatees were once confused oh, for gosh. mermaids. Oh gosh! Oh fuck! So yeah. Oh no! Oh no! 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 <laughs> How do you find Will Smith in the snow slash follow the Fresh Prince? Stop! Stop! Pay up, Dad. Tax. Pay up. Pay up. I want, how would e how would one even do it? They just whip it out and then like fold it like a taco around like like do you just use it like a taco to slide your fillings into or like or like do you do you have a hole to like I don't under <laughs> I don't understand why would <laughs> fold it <laughs> machine gun sound effect please mom. <gasps> Sorry, the machine gun jammed, I suppose. I've never been thankful for ads before. <laughs> oh, God. That's my favorite kind of Christopher job. Christopher Columbus allegedly had sex with, with a manatee because he thought it was a mermaid. Oh, yeah, let me just... <laughs> if you are happy and you know it, Womp. Womp! I... Yeah, let me just fuck this the sea wet wipe. <laughs> yeah, let me just. <laughs> oh yeah, this mermaid looks like a soggy wet wipe. Let me just uh, let me just fuck a sea wet wipe. Sh sure. <laughs> yeah, why I why not? A stinky orca <laughs> over a any day. Love you, Lily. Love you, womp womp. T H X for egg Lily and happy womp womp day. <laughs> Thank you! Oh, ah. da, 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 ba, 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 ba. <laughs> Happy Womp Womp! Thank you so much! How much money does a skunk have? Just know. a cent. Stop! Stop it! <laughs> Soggy croissant! <laughs> croissant! Croissant! 
Hello there. Is this Hello. Mary Womp Womp? Yes, this is Mary Hello Womp Womp. Hello there. Hello! Yeah, I don't know. What is so appealing about a manatee? It's just it's just a sea washcloth. What's the point? Black cow, Jesus. You need to relax. You're, you're spending too much money. Please think about yourself too. Well, after a few months on a cramped sailing vessel with nothing but a bunch of unwashed men, anything would look good. <laughs> you know what? Fair. I, yes, you know, fair. You have, thank you. Even Lily? I'm gonna go get a drink and then we go play Genshin. Fuck you guys. <laughs> I'm a, yeah, goodbye. I'm, I'm gonna go get a drink. Goodbye. G goodbye. Black cow, thank you for the five gifted! For fuck's sake! <laughs> it's game time! It's Genshin time. Nothing will ever match the sheer eroticism of the sheer padding of the majestic mermaid, I mean manatee. <laughs> oh, TTS monster is not working as we speak. Uh, I'll keep Hi, it Lily. off for the sponsor. How are you doing? Hello, it seems Mads. I barged in during a disturbing discussion again. Hearing it without any context is all sorts of hilarious. Have a good weekend, yes. Lily. Thank you. You cat. too. I, womp I womp. hope you enjoy the As topics. some would say, if it has a hole. I, okay, and that's why I'm leaving the sea taco conversation. I'm getting a drink. Goodbye. Lily Womp Womp. Seven 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 seven. Orcas are known to bully other sea life, including beluga whales and manatees and muds. Thankfully we have humpback whales and shrimps to play the blockers for the more gentle sea life out there. Beep 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 boop boop beep 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 boop boop Yes, we do bully. What about it? Wait, what does Lily do with that feel? Please do not diddle this feel. Diddle? <laughs> What's diddle? Have a good night or good morning chat. Love you all and remember to always stay positive, Womp Womp. Thank you! Womp Womp! Good night, sleep well, Captain. 
We are gonna swap over. What the fuck is this? We are gonna swap over to some Genshon. Are you ready? Yes, of course you are. Of course you are. Yeah, let's go. Genshon. Oh, wait, I didn't take my D yet. Let me take my more with the mans. Ma with the mans. I'll take more with the mans. It's sponsor time! Sponsored swipings. Um I might I might need you guys' help. Uh you need to let me onto your map so I can farm uh specific enemies. Because I don't think I can immediately max out Dea's weapon with what I have right now. I don't think. Can you read this? Salang hey yo, cool kwabeki. It's for hiyo. someone who love you. Salang, salang hey yo, cool kwa, cool, cool kwabeki. Dad here. Hiyo. How do you make a water bed bouncier? Cool kwabeki. You use spring water. <laughs> spring star. <laughs> No, stop! No one help her! Yes! I need helpers! Okay, first I'll I'll take my D though. I'll take my D though. Why do cows wear bells? It was not a good one. Stop. Because no. their horns stopped working. Stop it! No more dad jokes! If I can update the game in time, I got you. It'll take a while before I need them. Uh, cause I'll first find my own Just as well. Do it. Make your dreams so, yes. come true. It means I love you, Honey Tsuros. Wait, it does. Honey Tsuros means ko kwa ko kwa beki. Honey Tsuros. Wait. I knew what Sarang Hyo means. But I didn't know it's her birthday tomorrow. Well, it doesn't work. Yeah, it's her birthday tomorrow. Well, uh, maybe already now, because I think it's like midnight or something. So it, it it may or may not be now. I, I don't I don't know. Wait. Give me a second. It's Chi Chi's birthday? Wait, is it? Today? Much love. Been a wild time and glad to be here. Thank also, you! Much does a graveyard weigh question mark slash a skeleton? Stop. Stop. Lily, if you had mouse pads, I put a frog on it, cause it'd be a lily pad. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> that one's cute. Oh my god. I hate it! Did you know that diarrhea is hereditary? Mm? Because it runs in your genes. Stop. Why why are you like this? Why stop? Stop. <laughs> oh goodness. Uh let me fix my tablet. I have a new background on my tablet. Wait, before you play. Before we play, oh, camera covered, my bad. Let me show you. It's so cute. I have a new tablet background. I need to share with you first. When dad jokes become annoying, just remember a good masturbation joke always comes in handy. Stop, stop, stop. What is wrong with you? I send it. 
So I should be able to open it here. Why aren't koalas seen as bears? Slash they don't meet the koalifications. What is stop? No, stop. Please. What please. do you call a two hundred year old buffalo? I don't Bicentennial. know. I hate you. Anyway, check out this. My new background. My new tablet background. It's so cute. Banana films, handlebars, and banana moth. It's so cute. And then there's also some stinky orca. <laughs> it's so cute. I love it. It's so adorable. <laughs> it's so nice. I'm not one yeah, to usually say background. this, but if the but dad jokes continue, emote only chat would be a blessing. <laughs> Thank you! I'm glad I'm not the only one who hates dad jokes. They're so oh they're horrible. They're they're just so bad. Those unreads give me anxiety. I I don't I don't check Discord anymore. I, I just do not. I it's chat you don't understand it's getting out of hand it it doesn't that's why i have busca <laughs> it's getting out of hand i can't 18k unread emails yeah business email it's uh yeah it's convenient that you all are making all these dad jokes because ladies these days so very want daddies ah <laughs> <sighs> oh. Alright, let's do play Genshin! Oh, I'm gonna have to adjust Genshin volume. I can hardly handle six! Listen, once you become a streamer... Well, not streamer. Once you make... Online business, you will get numb the notifications because that's just kind of what your life is at that point did you hear about the man who lost his left arm and left leg no i hear he's all right now and he also works at ihop stop yeah mind if i give you some ear nibbles no ear nibbles no no i saw a similar pic lately but they weren't as thickly clothed in that one tongue. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> a man walks into a seafood store carrying a trout under his arm. Slash slash. Do you make fish cakes? Slash slash. He asked. Dot slash slash. Yes, we do. Replied the fishmonger. Slash slash. Great, said the man. It's his birthday and he heeds something special. I hope Stop. the mods are mentally prepared for the incoming streamer luck. Well, first, I'm gonna go kill the boss one more time, real quick. What do you call an No, I'm literally not even reacting to this anymore! I give me these real quick. Oops. Oh, finally. Okay, so I have 41 of these. I need. Let me check. <laughs> I need 46. So I have to kill those a little bit more, but I'll have Daya for that. Um, I have the pooper. If you keep making dad jokes. They will never come back with the milk. Yes. I have the pupa. I have the pupa. I also have the uh the, the headbands. The the silk, yes. The red silks. Um this is where I might need your help, because uh, clearly as you can see I don't have quite enough. I'm gonna make my round. But that's because, so the first time I farmed these, I got super lucky. Almost everyone I killed dropped the purple one. Then I farmed them again yesterday, and not a single freaking mob dropped a purple one. None! None of them! I've never been so unlucky. But uh, I'll kill my own first and see if I need help later. 
We'll see, we'll see. How many of them dropped? I have, I have no idea. I didn't quite count them. Lily, there was a kidnapping yeah. at Center Parks Elementary. After almost eight hours, he woke up. Huh? Oh my... Stop! Hey, Lily. Have considered traveling to Paris with French Express train TGV? No. Oh, and have some shrimples? Shrimples? Uh, shrimples? I'll probably go to Paris by car. Uh, I think Busca wants to drive. Most likely. If not, we will go there uh, by plane. We'll fly it. But, uh, yeah. Now we focus on Genshon. Because, um, this is sponsored streams. So I have to keep it slightly more professional than the, the, the non-sponsored Genshin streams. Ever so slightly more. But, um... Can visit us at the TwitchCon rival stage at Paris? Wait, that's a rival? Wait, what is a rival stage? Wait, Taylor, what? Yes, I'll be there, most likely. It depends. Uh, I talked to my partner manager for like, um, I want to schedule a meet and greet because, um... <laughs> My dumbass held him. Okay, so last TwitchCon in EU, uh, I held a meet and greet as well, but um, uh, I didn't have a meet and greet spot, so I just tweeted out, "Hey, um, if you wanna come meet me, uh, just meet me like here at this spot in the artist alley." <laughs> we 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 were responsible for one massive line. I, it was first okay okay the shrimps were well organized my shrimp my chat was insanely well organized we, they even left room they left like a space for like the the fire accident shit like that but we took over the entirety of the artist alley it was it was like three four hours of just meeting shrimps like hey how you do uh sign this uh, selfie okay bye next love you thank you <laughs> um but yeah, the gems behaved a lot. So um, I asked my manager for a proper meet and greet because we made security very angry. But I think that I did slight because everyone was really nice. Like the shrimpies were very nice. So that I did slight most likely because because uh, the manager of the actual building came over as well and he was like giving me the stanky side eye and then a bunch of security guards came over gave, giving me the stanky side eye but then eventually the security guards were really chill and then one of them sat down he was just numbing some fucking fries the other one was just chilling talking <laughs> chatting <laughs> it was it was fun after a while but it was very scary when suddenly big men in suits showed up and then just kept sitting down while giving me the side eye and then this one reporter kept shoving his goddamn camera in my face i'm like can't you see i'm a vtuber i wear a mask for a reason my man literally crouched he, he crouched on the floor to get like a picture of me and like with my face signing something i'm like I'm, my man i don't know if this obvious but I I wear a mask for a reason if you haven't quite noticed yet. It's <laughs> so weird. Nobody put him in place so bad. Oh my god. Fucking Numi MVP. She told him off. Um I mean I guess he was just doing his job, but fuck was he persistent like a goddamn fly. Ills ills, yeah. They were happy when they improbbed the meet and greet happened. They were just making sure no emergency access were being blocked. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They seemed very really chill with everything, but they looked very angry. But they they seemed happy with how everything was handled. So, yeah. I'm asking for an actual meet and greet. So, uh, I hope I can also make it to the TwitchCon Rivals thing. That, that'd be cool. I'll, I'll, I'll love that. Also, my kid will boss one more time for Daya. He wanted an article, but I had no concept of consent. Like, it's probably his his job, right? Like, dad ass, he was probably hired by Twitch to like, uh, I don't know, make a nice web page or some shit. But please not with the face of people that are trying to cover their face. <laughs> like, as a reporter, you gotta have some sort of like, uh, um, I don't know, like like common sense. There's this person that covers their face and turns away. Maybe they don't want to be here. Just a, just a thought. Ah, 
but almost died. Alright, oh, how many do I have now? Uh, I only got two! Dude, I swear, this boss has been cursed. This is. I think I've only gotten three, like. Maybe he was a paparazzi twice. and he wants pick of what's hidden. <laughs> should have wear a nut mask. Yes, I should have. Like, how? I d I've gotten three drops twice. I need to kill him another time. Fuck. Okay. A two whole items. Wow. 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 Anyway, um, I am gonna stand over here. I am gonna show you the new character. Because, oh my gosh. I've been waiting for her for a while. She is probably the first character I've been beyond hyped about since I know. Look at her. Look at her! Gah! <laughs> oh, Mommy Daya! God, she is... She, she is... She, sexy. God, she is... She is a woman who doesn't need no man. Look at her! Gosh, I love her. And uh, I haven't quite figured out what's the best artifact set for her because in the trial, they gave her a full support artifact set. They just gave her a four piece Melilith. That's it. I would like to know what stats they are, but I'm guessing they are uh, the goblet, helmet, and uh, sans pieces are probably all HP because in this play test, she has almost 40k HP, which is like what my Kokomi has. And she has all HP as well. No, I think she has one healing. Cinder has been loving playing that character. Yes! But she is so freaking good. But in a playtest, they give her a full support set. Which, uh, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not sure why. Like, why not give her like a nice DPS set? Like... There is, uh, ever since yesterday, there is four sets I wanna try on her. God, I love her. Pressing that Q, oh, it feels so good. It feels so powerful. Lily, I am yeah. sorry for all the jokes. Please take this as my form of apology <laughs> you. for your torture and my pleasure. Much love to you and everyone here. <laughs> Thank you! I'll, I will. Also, I'm gonna put chat somewhere else. Boys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna scoop you over here. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you with me. You stay with me. No. You. Mm, me. You're with me, I think. Yeah. You, you, you stay with me. Yeah. But she feels like so much fun. Uh, in this playtest, she is C0. Alright, alright. But, so, okay. There is four artifact sets that I think could work really well with Dea. Four. Well, technically five, but four complete sets. So, let me show you, let me show you. Uh, I'm gonna just use... Uh, Nine months swamp womp. Um, I'm gonna just use a uh, gene to show off the artifact sets, right? Okay. I get what you mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um. So, I think there's four potential ones. The first one, of course, four piece Merlilith with. I don't know if she wants to have HP in all three slots. That's another thing I have to find out yet. Or if she wants attack percent, pyro damage, and crit rate, like like normal DPS, or if she scales better with, deep, with just full HP <laughs> everywhere. I don't know yet. Uh, I guess that's just there's loads of testing to be done. Um, HP scaling is meh. What if you have her C1 though? What if you have her at least C1? Do you still wanna go with attack percent? Cause because C1 gives her extra HP and gets her more scaling of HP. 
Emblem of Severed Fate, HP, Substat? Mmm, that could work. So you want HP scaling almost the same? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. HP Goblet for sure in C1. Alright, alright. So, you guys think HP Goblet, not Pyro DPS Goblet? So, Sans and uh, Circuit, I'm guessing, are just so attack and So this is off-topic, but my co-workers and I yeah. have had a week-long argument about these books. Harry Potter or Lord of the Rings? Uh... Well, I haven't seen Lord of the Rings, so probably Harry Potter. Yeah, she needs lots of ER, which is why I think... Okay, so obvious choice. Uh, the way her skill works, she is an obvious, amazing contender for uh, sub-DPS Middleness set. We all agree. Four-piece Middleness, kind of a no-brainer. Also, four-piece um, Crimson Witch, also kind of a no-brainer if you want her, her to be an actual DPS DPS. But I have two more sets that I think could work really well, and I'll try and test them all. First... 4P's emblem. Why? Because apparently she needs lots of ER because her old charge is slow. She has shitty particle generation and high energy costs. So 4P is severed fate. It could work. It could work. Yeah, I need I need loadout sets, please. Hi. Holy ways. That could work. So maybe a 4P is severed fate. She is ER hungry, and the HP scaling, while cool, maybe not all that important, you know, just, just, you know, Emblem might be a really good set. However, I have also considered the possibility, let me think, what was it? Oh no, I think I have forgotten. I wanted to give her a two-piece noblesse because it gives her elemental burst damage. Oh no, I've forgotten the other option. Only here a couple of days a month, but keep up the wholesome streams. Was Seems it was good. it just I think it was two piece crimson. Yeah yeah yeah. I think I think it was two piece noblesse and two piece crimson. That could also work. I think. I believe. The animal said what wh why animal damage? <laughs> I was thinking maybe I don't know. I'd I think <laughs> four piece clam set. Wait, why clam? Is there something I'm missing? No, ain't no way. What? Nah. How would she proc that? She heals very little, doesn't she? Nah. Because of her passive. It's a mean build. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure Clem. I feel like if you wanna build her support, just give her a four piece middle list. That's a no brainer. I feel like Clem is too. You might as well just run with a sub DPS. Chances are because she's in pyro DPS, you are going to pair her with Bennett anyway. So it doesn't really matter. But so my sets are either four piece middle list. No brainer, but I don't want it to be a sub DPS or support. Or a four piece Crimson Witch. Or four piece emblem. I think it could work really well, that ass. Or two piece noblesse and two piece crimson. Because two piece noblesse, twenty percent elemental burst damage, with fifteen percent pyro, big Q damage. And then you would smash her into the same group as Bennett and Raiden. So she would gain lots of particles by having the double pyro. Bennett generates pyro particles, and um, Venti and Raiden are both going to be batteries for her as well. I think. I think I'd, I don't know. That's that's my plan for tonight. Testing these out, cause I'm gonna be honest. I'm pretty sure. Emblem is gonna yo, be the set to go. If Remind you wanna that to add Shai Eat on 7 TV, it's really good, I promise, Swamp. <laughs> what is Shai T? Kazuha is must for support. Why Kazuha over Venti? Explain. I wanna know why. Why Why not Venti? Isn't Venti a much be bigger battery than Kazuha? The cool factor? 
Okay, okay. Why, 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 why Kazuha? What am I missing? Kazuha to boost her abysmal day, MG. <laughs> when you can see scene do some crazy stuff with burning scaling? I think so too. And and Venti is a battery as for well, like big battery. He adds more damage for her. How does Kazuha add more damage than Venti? Wait, am I missing something? Can she hit the characters in Venti Q to begin with? He boosts elemental damage, but Venti is a battery. And Venti also boosts uh, a bunch of damage. Hi, Womp Womp Mother. I love you. Yeah. You're the best tuber I <laughs> Thank see. Thank you! I love you, Womp 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 Mother of Womp. Uh, yeah, Sucrose might be better, but I don't have a build Sucrose. I only have Venti and Kazuha built. My Sucrose is very behind. Uh, this is my Venti right here. My Venti is level 80 with rank 5 Allergy. My Kazuha has rank 1 Freedom Schwan Schwan. Uh, also, 4 P's Viridescent, of course. And uh, my Kazuha is C1, because why not? My Venti is C6, though. And uh, this one decreases. C2 decreases resistance. Didn't play Genshin in a while. The only thing I got was smash and tea higher. Okay, I guess. <laughs> okay, I guess. I have a C2 Venti, which would decrease the animal resistance. Not bad to have, but I think it is... Uh... Yeah, this one decreases elemental resistance of whatever is being uh, swirled, which will be pyro. So that's 20% pyro damage, basically. So that's that's pretty poggies. I I don't know how Kasuha would be doing more than that. Mm Because Kazuha just buffs his own damage, it's, I think. Mm. Elemental damage bonus ups up by a swirl upon of elemental mastery has for 8 seconds. See, I don't think I have enough EM on Kazuha, because my artifacts kind of suck. I have EM, animal damage, EM. Uh, this one has EM, this one has EM. How much EM do I have? Mm, 800 ten, right, actually kind of alright I guess how much are you supposed to have on Kazuha I guess it's Aid 1k you're supposed to have 1k listen 800 is just casual like that is literally 800 is not that it's decent but it's not that great my substats are kinda yikes. 700 EM is a low investment goal. <laughs> as close to 1k as you can. Alright, alright. I think I'll try both. I'll try Venti and Kazuha. Because I'm pretty convinced that with C6 Venti, uh, I'll have more damage through Venti than I'll have with C1 Kazuha. Anyway. To test V need to roll so let's roll first oh wait we already did a test run didn't we right yeah we did our test run right i've just shown you off right no yes i did am i having a, i'm having the weirdest deja vu that okay yes we did that was so weird fuck it is chi chi's birthday oh shit that's so cute I love the birthday system in Genshin. All oh, right, I forgot to charge my primals. Uh... <laughs> I'll be right back. I'll be right back. It's swiping time, I forgot. <laughs> I wanted to buy him before stream, but I was distracted farming poopa. I need the poopa. Alright, uh, 
C6? I don't know yet. I My goal is minimum C1, but I'm considering C4. I don't see the reason to C6, honestly. I don't think C6 is like... A game changer. I, I don't I don't think any of her constellations are game breaking to be honest, but I feel like if you go for constellations C1 or C4 probably And she's going on standard banner, so you know, maybe just make her C4 cuz eventually we are going to see C6 anyways She she will be on standard banner Yeah, C6 will come around eventually C1 is bad damage, C4 kinda takes care of ER problems, C6 gives okay damage. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna go for C4, cause... Yeah, I'll... I did collect the 5 month monthly summons already, yeah. I did, I did. So, uh... Yeah, I, th I think I'll do C4. I don't really need more, to be honest. Oh. Ignore. Don't don't mind me accidentally tapping out. <laughs> Middle of wishing. All right, first one. All right, leaked. Oh no, I've leaked my ascension planner. Oh no. How did you hit Alt Tab? I didn't hit Alt Tab. I accidentally clicked outside the screen. My my mouse was right here, and if I click outside the screen, I I. Genshin closes down, school. and it just opens whatever is behind Genshin, so... Yeah. That- that's how. Quick, read the tabs! Oh no! Ooh, good pull though. Okay, okay. Not so lucky so far, I get it, I get it. Mm-hmm. Yikes. Uh, excuse you? Where is my streamer look? Why do I have to go to pity? Hello? Hello? <laughs> streamer look! They are doko. <laughs> this is hard the pity. <laughs> In the way! Okay, but it's okay. We didn't lose our 50-50, so we'll be fine. Oh god, Bennett, you scared me. <gasps> what did I say? Okay, like, alright. I told you that it's okay. I, I'll, I'll gladly have pity if that means I won't lose the 50-50. Holy shit, yes. Oh, hello, Layla. Six months. Ah, fuck, thank you. Weapon time. Okay, I already have the beacon selected. Oh gosh, why is this weapon in here? All right, Sino. Oh, oh shoot. I really don't want his weapon. I really just want Dea's weapon, to be honest. The bacon. Hello, Skyward Harib. I wanna be upset, but that's literally my first pull on this weapon banner. I don't think I can be upset. Uh, like, I wanna be upset, but that's literally a one... A one pity weapon. I don't... I can't really be upset, can I? <laughs> I mean, it's official ball. That's funny, because... Funny... Be what what the fuck is special? <laughs> funny, because she does indeed have that ball. <laughs> so I guess I can just uh, refine it. Give me that. <laughs> oh! <laughs> yeah, I guess that's... Yeah, I guess Fischl has a ranked silver ball now. Thank you. I mean, like, how much pity was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That was literally my eighth pull. I, I don't, I, 
Yeah, I'll take it! Eight pulls in, five stars, go! I'm cool with that. Okay, well, don't make me unlucky now. <laughs> Have some! Don't, don't play me now! Shy pogging, shy pogging. Poggies. Alright. Okay. Okay. Please. Oh! Alright. Please be Dea's weapon. Please! Don't give me the pole arm. Please don't give me the pole arm. I do not the pole arm. Please. Please. I need the bacon. Give me the bacon. Give me the bacon! Oh, yes. Thank... Oh, my gosh. Bacon! Okay, fuck! We got the bacon! We got the bread. Boys, we got the bread. We got the bread. Bread, 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 bread. Where's Daya? Oh, here she is. Get that, get that weapon out of your hands. That filthy, filthy, boom, much better weapon. Fourteen months already. Much better weapon. Shy, hyper shy, bop shy, roll. Beautiful. Am I the only one who would have wished for like a red weapon? Like this looks so nice on her, doesn't it? I mean, this weapon looks amazing. Mazaki, thank you for the raid. <laughs> thank you so much for playing Genshin. Let's go. Hello, raiders. I hope your raid, uh, your raid. Oh my, I can't talk. I hope your stream has been fun. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I think this one would have been a little nicer if it was red. It would have been nice. Even this one would have looked really nice, to be honest. Unforged data is looking kind of cool. Either way, we'll see what this one looks like when upgraded. Come on, bacon! I should have enough to get the weapon up to a pretty decent degree. Uh, I can't max it yet, but that's okay. Because I don't have enough of these, the little shells. Because I got super unlucky yesterday when farming them. And I didn't farm them today yet, but yes. Oh yeah, gravestone probably looks amazing. How do I not have a gravestone? How the fuck? Thank you, I switch! We got the bike on. God, uh, Hoyo Warriors, if you could let us use more than 20 w weapons at once, that'd be great. <laughs> I'd, I would, I would very much appreciate that. that. That'd be amazing. Thanks. <laughs> please, I, I need more than 20. <laughs> Hoyo, please. This is the real gameplay. Enhancing their weapons. And on PlayStation, this is a way faster process. Um when I when I'm on PlayStation, I usually only farm. But um I did level some characters on my PlayStation uh, quite a while back. This is a much faster process on PlayStation because on a controller you can skip this window popping up. You can just smash button through. Would it work the same with controller? Ain't no way. Let's wait. I wanna test. I wanna see. If it has... You can press escape. <gasps> no! Don't tell me! Oh, oh. I pressed escape. One too many. At what point do I press escape? 
Oh my god. No. Escape so high. Let me let me see it controlling. Also, chat, that is. I'm not being stupid. I'm just asking. Because you usually know better. Is there Does it automatically connect the controller on PC? I think I need to have it in the settings. Control type. Controller. Oh, and I also need... Oh, no. Uh, on my PlayStation... I changed these around. No, no, stop. Oh, fuck. No, stop! Oh my god. Uh, controller set up. Okay, this is much better. Much better. Uh, on controller also, when you get weapons... Uh, let me show you. When you go into your inventory. On controller, when you get weapons... Four-star weapons... Uh, do we have multiple in a row? Yeah, right here. You can... You can click them. And you can lock and unlock them super fast. But on PC, to my knowledge, there is no such keybind to do this very fast. Because you have to literally... On, on PC, what you have to do is you have to like... Click them and then unlock them one by one. On controller, you have a keybind for that. When do we get that on 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 keyboard? Cause this is a lifesaver. This this is this is insane. I love this so much. It saves so much time. So much. It's insane. I need it on PC? Yes, I need it too. Uh, also, they are... Where is she? Here. Weapon. Enhance. Because you can just auto add. Oh, wait. Mm. Cannot add four stars? Oh, no. I have to select materials by hand. All right. Let's go. That's going to take a hot second. It'll take a while. Oh, yes. But... That's all I wanted to show on controller. On my PC, I obviously prefer to not be on controller. But I realized on my PlayStation that unlocking a weapon has an actual keybind. And it was, it was, it was so nice. It felt, it felt so nice. I loved it. It was, it was so much fun. Being able to just skip it like that. If you press shift when you hover over the weapon, it will lock and unlock it. Wait, it does? <gasps> With shift? No. My life has been a lie. Wait. No. Even though I pulled Chi Chi, I'm still going to have fun. Maybe. Does it not work in this window? Does it only work when I'm outside this window? Maybe. Shy, happy, shy, <laughs> happy one year with the orchid. Chat light, Sag. Wait, I'm I'm testing it now. I'm going to my inventory. Sorry. Hi. Hi. It does the work of shift. Control. No. Shift. Right shift. It doesn't work. It only works on controller, for me, I guess. Hi. Sag. I'm getting one guy. What does it even mean? <laughs> 
<laughs> oh shit, also, I think drops are enabled for Genshin, aren't they? Mm. Let me see. They are, yes? Uh, yes. Let me just uh, put that into stream title. Why don't we have the drops enabled tag? That's so weird. Usually, that tag gets auto added to a stream. Why is it not here? Huh? That's so weird. Too many tags, maybe? No, because it's one of the auto edit tags, usually. Let me go to my dashboard to make sure that we actually do have drops. Uh, Viva Rewards. Drops. Um. Genshin. Yeah, we do. Why don't we have the drops tag? You already have 10? That, that doesn't make sense. The, you, you don't understand. There is tags that you can add yourself. Right here. And then there's tags that will be added no matter what. No matter how many. The drops tag is always mm. here. Uh -huh. It's it's not a tag you add yourself. It's a tag that gets auto added based on game uh -huh. and connection to the game. The category ones. Why is it not work? That's so weird. Wait, but my drops come on, Twitch. Where's my drops tag? Let me fix that real quick. I'll. D I'll just add it manually myself, fuck it. <laughs> Cause now if you click the drops enable tag, we don't even show up. Skamas. Removing the stinky tag. Drops enabled. Okay. Now if I go to Genshin. And I refresh. And I click on drops enable. I'm still not there because it's a fake tag. What is. Hello? Twits? Are you okay? I'm getting shadow banned on Twits. <laughs> um, am I shadow banned or something? What is going on? Hello? That's so weird. Yeah, people are getting credit towards oh. the drops, but womp womp. where are the drops? <sighs> Is Taylor still in chat? I doubt. Hello? <laughs> At Twitch? Your system is broken. It doesn't work. <laughs> Why don't I have drops? I also don't show up if you check out channels that have drops enabled. I'm just not there. Why? I reload my page. I can see the Twitch drops now. Because I added it myself as like my own tag. But it doesn't count as an official tag. Because when you click it, it doesn't actually show the drops enabled streamers. I'm so confused. Oh. <laughs> I'll hand in a formal complaint to Genshin. Uh, not, not to Genshin, Jesus. To my partner manager, Twitch partner manager. I don't get drops? That's so dumb. Secret hidden drops. It ruins the algorithm. Half the point of stermazing st is that you get the drops. My game is frozen right now, yeah, because I'm tapped out. <sighs> It is active, but I don't have the official drops enable tag. I only have the fake tag. You can tell because when you do go... That's so stupid. I see you on there though. It doesn't... Okay, it doesn't work for me and I'm not stupid. 
look if you if you if you browse Genshin, here we are, right? If you browse Genshin, uh, viewers, hi to low. You browse Genshin, we are here, right? We are here. You click on a person that actually does have the official drops enable tag, and then removes us. We are not under the official Twitch given category tag. That's so stupid. Okay, anyway, back to Genshin. We're continuing to sponsor it, because clearly it ain't Genshin's fault, but that's so scum scummy of Twits. Because it still hurts the sponsor! The sponsor is relying on the fact that we have drops. The drops enable tag is only up because I put it there, but it doesn't count as an actual official tag. It's a fake tag, because I put it there myself. Which, which is bad for the sponsor, because they are... A requirement of the stream is that I stream of drops enabled. That's so weird. That that fucks the sponsor. I don't and why? Twitch is so scuffed. I hate it. Um, I can maybe text my partner manager real quick. So maybe he can fix it. I see you under the tag drops enabled, not the fake one, one from another streamer. Okay, interesting. Um, I might just shoot an email super quick to my partner manager. This is why I wish so bad that he would just handle things over Discord because he ain't gonna see this email until like three days later. I texted my partner manager, I'm sorry for the sponsor, but that's all I can do. I it's it's it, it's not in my power to do anything else. I yeah. It's up now, is it? Let me see. It is working now for me. Let me see. I'm refreshing my page. Oh my god, Twitch is so slow, please. Why are you so slow? It's not for me. I it on it still only has my actual manually enabled one. I see you on the drops on mobile that Oh well, I ain't gonna pay any more attention to that. That's just unfortunate. Let's help Twitch fixes their stupid mistakes. It'd be cool if the website would work just once a year. Is it something you need to set up before yes. you start and streaming, I did. or is it, it something is. else? It is set up. It is. It is something you need to set up before stream, and I have. It's enabled, and I've worked every other stream before. Thank you, Panda! Um, Where was I? Weapon. We go get weapon. I wish I would have like a way to auto add four stars, cause I don't, I don't want to manually add them all. Wap wap. I know chat real problems. I, I'm sorry. I can't help it. Click, try, click and drag. I, th th there is no. <gasps> Since when? No, wait, how do I just do that? How do I? <gasps> Hi, Lily. I don't get to make it to stream often, 
but I constantly spend my It was just edited That's amazing Thanks for helping get me through Thank the day. you. Womp womp. Okay, I need uh, 16 more of these. Thank you so much. It makes me really happy. Actual death in chat. It was literally just added. Oh my god, that's amazing. You can drag now. <gasps> I love that. Also, the weapon looks much cooler now that it's golden. It has like a golden shine now. It looks much cooler with the gold. Thank you. Um... I'm gonna give her who tiles that for now, I think. The four piece crimson. Actually, mm. hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna give her four piece crimson for now. Including the HP goblet? Or do I give her an attack goblet? Chat, what do I do? Do I give her the HP goblet? HP? ER? Well, I can make this one ER maybe. I I cannot. Fuck. I can, I think. Because I have a crit damage one. It ain't the best stat wise, but it will do for now because I think a weapon yeah, it gives crit raid. If a six yeah, that that that's a good enough split. So I can give her an ER one. Do I have an- wait, do I have an ER one that isn't being used right now? By anyone of importance? Greetings oh wait, I'm so Germany stupid. Smile. I can't make this one ER. It only ha right. Um, I don't- wait. I can still- I can- Where's who tells? Power damage? Hey, Lily Wimp Wimp. <laughs> wimp Wimp! I can. Well, I can steal this one. This one's pretty alright. Yeah, I can. I can steal Shing Shows for now. Boop. Four P's with ER. We can level her up. For a hot second. I think I should have everything to level her to max. I think. I might have to craft uh, the gems though. I might have to craft the gems. For emblem a lot better than crimson. Crimson lowers the damage. Does it? Should we should we give back who tell what we robbed, and give her the emblem instead? Yes. All right. We'll do. I do have who tell. Yes. In fact, More they are Lily. just store More hotels Wamp stuff. Wamp Wamp! Uh, need a few ones of these. Flop. Why would Crimson lower her damage? I don't know. I'm gonna trust chat, I suppose. Yeah, I need to craft the pile of things real quick. But... I wanna... Already... In this state... I wanna make a team for her. I wanna kill this boss with her already. With the current set, the way it is. Mm. I think I'll put Raiden in here. This should work, I think. Do they all have artifacts? Alright, should work. Should work.
What's Dea's talent level? It's still one. I mean, I guess we can already upgrade them some. Uh, I have enough to make it 566 six, basically. Uh, but I'm not sure how important auto attack is. I'll just level up this one first. That is indeed a controller. Yes, it is. Well observed. Should I, should I be higher? Can you see it better now? <laughs> 166 would be good. Alright, 166 it is. Press talent reference on top. I don't believe in talent reference. I do what I think is best. Not what talent reference suggests. Okay, um... Yeah, we'll see. Lurked for so long, ah. glad to finally be able to sub less them. <laughs> Ram free. Ram, thank you! Oh, I have to teleport away. Hold up. Yeah, I could hear weapon. But, um, I need some more materials. Her auto attack scaling is bad. Okay, but what if we. <laughs> what if we see Six Bennett though? And then slap pyro damage on her <laughs> with a crimson set. Lily, no? That would work? I mean. I think it would work. Do not. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying it could work. Love your new model and love your live streams. <laughs> Whoa. 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa! Do I still have to... How does C6 Bennett work? Do I still have to level my auto attack if I have C6 Bennett? Or does that not... Does it... Do I have to level Daya's auto? Yes? No? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm mad? Good. Be mad. Look at that. Look at... Oh, sorry. Look at that. Be mad. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> I love you, Lily. You are so cute. Shy, I love, love you too! <laughs> Welcome. Oh shit, I can't do higher. Oh yes. Oh yes. <laughs> As someone who had C6 Bennett in the first two hours of the game's release, welcome Lily really Shine. <laughs> welcome! Welcome! Oh, wait, okay, okay, relax. Raiden, Jesus Christ. Relax. I, I wanted to test my kill. No! No! Just. Just. Uh, no! <laughs> just as he despawned! Fuck! That is unfortunate timing. That 
that is um unfortunate timing. <laughs> What are Bennett's best constellation? I'm gonna be honest, I don't know. I just see five them because I cut it from pretty much the beginning. And uh, I called it a day from there. As someone who knows very little about Genshin, I have no idea what just happened. <laughs> but seeing evil Lily happy brings me joy anyway. Let's just see that C6 in the character I just C6 um, is like a crime. <laughs> to commit in this game and the worst part about this crime is that you can't take the crime back so um <laughs> so so yeah also i don't play eula because i literally wasted 60 plus of the fucking uh resin recharge thingies what are they called you know what i mean 60 plus on a stream only to get three mediocre pieces of the pale flame set and not even finish four set. That's how bad. That's that's how bad. The pain flame set. Yes. I said the why? Jesus! That is a the, the hello? What the fuck? No. Jeez, thank you! V -v 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 -v. Oh my goodness. Wait. What do I hear? Um, I'm gonna just... Uh, fuck it. Oop. I've probably played this game for about three total hours since its release. So as someone with absolutely no skin in the game, go ahead Lily, scrap <laughs> anyone, spend everything or whatever it is you're doing. Make go ahead Lily! Wait, do I need these? Which ones do I need? And what ascension are we? Yes. Oh, I will. Do we need to kill the boss one more time? <gasps> we do not! I'm happy that I was here to witness this. <laughs> you have witnessed total ascension. What if we just ah. accept D higher as she is? Due to her kit most likely being buffed with future characters slash area releases like Shenho with Ayaya, Electro with Denro or Barbara with Infinite Bloom Reactions KM makes it. Oh, I, I mean... <laughs> I mean, I, I love her the way she is. I don't, I don't see your problem. I, I've been waiting for her for so long. Okay, I need to farm more of these. Got it. She has this as artifact set. Though, I want to try... Chai egg. Egg. Mm, I'm gonna try slapping this onto her instead. Give it to me. Look, I... I She already has to swan energy recharge. Okay, if I have a four-piece emblem though, right? If if I decide to slap a four-piece emblem on her, do I still want an energy recharge sense? Or do I go attack Prasanda? With four-piece mlem mlem. ER still, yeah? ER. Attack sense? ER sends four piece with a tag. We are very 50 50, I think. We're very split. Um, mm. Mm. HP sends though. Oh, H. I didn't even consider that possibility, but I don't think I can make that work. Uh, uh, I'll try. Give me a second. Because... Um... I need this one to already be an offset. I only have these three options, unfortunately. Attack, energy recharge... And, uh, another energy recharge. I don't have an HP one ready to go, do I? Energy recharge, attack... Nope! 
Yeah, I don't know how. I'll, I'll try to attack one. I'll see. Because I have Raiden in my team as well. So it hopefully should work. Now she can keep the Pyro one. We have four Ps with Pyro damage one. And... We have a decent split. Alright, I'll, I'll try this one. I'll try this one. In fact, I think the best way to test if this works... Uh, first, I'm gonna go craft. Is to go kill the boss again. And see if I feel like it deals more damage. Does Raiden still work with Daya though? Ah, uh, she should. Yeah. She should be a battery. Like, a bigger battery, basically. I suppose. Uh... I guess I can just steal some... Oh, heck. I'll take the cryo one, I suppose. Floop. Convert. The thing is, I'm either thinking of Raiden or uh, Miko in the team. I don't know what I want yet. It's my birthday today. I'm turning Dancing, thank today. you. <sighs> thank you so much. So I think I'll stick to Raiden for now and I'll see if I'm overcapping energy, which I doubt. If I do overcap energy, I could probably replace Raiden with Miko because she just has a 4 ps uh, thundering. And she gives less energy, I believe, to Daya. But yeah, happy birthday! Let's go, punching! Let's have a look. Oh shit, I have no energy for Benny kill. Uh oh. Ganya support would be good too? Yes, but I don't have a good Ganya support build. I only have main damage, main DPS Ganyu. Oh my god. It wasn't up yet. Come on. Yes! Give me the Q! Boing, 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 boing. No, stop, stop, don't go away, please! Uh. Why are you like this? Good soup. Good soup. Oh right, I don't I don't need. Oh. <laughs> you can use your skill during burst or you just left click and it does the same thing. Mm, okay. I need a little bit extra. It's not that bad. Oh no, absolutely not. I literally oh uh this one. I literally don't even have a proper setup for her yet, but it works well. She isn't C6, that that's that's C0 Daya. That's I am thinking of getting more constellations though. I would like C4, I think, but I'm not sure. I don't know, man. Hmm. It would help a lot with her energy problems. I'll see first. I'll see. I'll see. Her C1 is a big jump in damage. Oh, I bet. How much, how much have I left from my wishing? Oh, I still have so much left over. You know what? Okay, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna just see one at least. At least see one. Minimum. 
we have all these extra primals. We might as well. Hello, Bennett. I'll like Daya instead, please. Thank you. C2? No, I... Hmm. Maybe? We could? It's not a gambling addiction. Chat, please. We'll just see how far we get dumping our leftover primals. C2 necessary, you think so? I do! Oh yeah, I will... Oh, wow, okay! Daya! Hello? Ah, good soup. Good soup. <laughs> oh, God! Followed by many Bennets. Gosh, I... <laughs> I'm not sure how comfortable I feel being sandwiched by all these... These Bennets. <laughs> That's a lot of Bennets. Chat, help! <laughs> many Bennets! She's getting some Bennies. Wom wom, how are you today? Amazing! Thank you! Also, did Genshin ever buff uh, Dendro and Pyro? The reactions? Because I'm gonna be honest, I wanna build a team with Nahida and Daya so bad. But I'm not sure if they work well together, Nahida and Daya. I, I feel like it's just not strong enough. No help, no prayers, that's where C6 sick Bennett. <laughs> um, where's my streamer like? Genshin, hello? It's a weak combo, yeah, it's a- What? Ah, 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 ah. Alright. Okay. Yes. <gasps> Wait, ain't no way. No. No. Ain't no way. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, Daya will be a standard banner, which is why the highest I would want to roll for her would be C4. Like, the highest. The by far highest. The pulls are rigged. Don't be jealous. Don't be jealous, chat. Don't be jealous. It's the C6 Bennett luck. The game knows I'm committed. The game knows. The game knows. It is aware. The gotcha gods have spoken. Come on, please, please. <gasps> the la okay, no, ain't no way on the last ten pull. No, ain't no way. Come on, C4 on the last ten pull, please. I see six Bennett for this. I see six Bennett, please. Yes. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> this is what happens if you see six your Bennett chat. Maybe you should. Tr oh, oh! I thought I was C four. Mm. I thought shit. Oh. I don't. Know. I thought I was C four. <laughs> I thought <laughs> I thought I, I blame the manatees. All that talk earlier in the dad joke spam gave her too much luck. Yes. Ta. 
I thought I thought she was C4. I can't. I <laughs> We can't do this. I <laughs> I thought she was No, I can't. My my brain. I I thought she... What the fuck are you doing here? On this banner? I thought <laughs> I thought it was C4. Okay, now my brain needs I need to see C4 Daya. I had it has to be be done now. I I, I cannot. I. <laughs> How much did you buy it? Uh, at least two primal gems. At at least two. At least two. Gamble addiction go b r r r r. <laughs> oh hello, Bennett. Fancy seeing you here. Oh gosh, I thought I was golden. Stop it. Come on, please. Yes. Oh my god. Easy 50-50 win. Easy. Look at this. Look at this. Bow. Skaboosh! This is the power of C6ing. You ban it. You are welcome. This is what happens if you see six Bennett. I uh, try it now. I <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is this is what happens. All you all you gotta do is y you know what you have to do. You know what you have to do. <laughs> all you gotta do is see six Bennett, and boom. There she is! <laughs> Ain't no way! <laughs> See, Six Sigma Bandit right now! <laughs> oh god, I messed up. I keep forgetting that this boss needs time to spawn! What damage? Okay, I've opened. Boink, boink, boink. Boink, 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 boink. No! Go back here! Fuck it. Oh my god. I already have ult back up. Ain't no way. How? That was so fast. <gasps> the C4 dream? It just works? Question mark? It just works? Shy rave, shy rave, shy Nellis, rave. Nellis, thank you. Okay, well, I need to upgrade the sword a little bit more though, still. So, I need to hunt these enemies because I've gotten incredibly unlucky with them. These ones right here. And hopefully this time, we're gonna get a little bit luckier, cause damn! I've been robbed, but I'm not sure if I'm mad, cause I have C4 Daya. You can also shop for monster mats too. I don't think so. I don't... I don't think I can. <laughs> I, don't, <laughs> I don't think I uh, have the facilities to do so. <laughs> okay, come here, big scorpion fish. <laughs> Boink, 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 boink. It's already dead! I didn't finish yet! <gasps> I got a purple though. Very good. Very nice. My luck continues. Alright. More. 
I got crazy HP without having a singular HP artifact. What? Where the fuck did 33k HP come from? I don't even have HP artifacts equipped. It's it's ER it, it's attack percent parallel damage crit. The weapon? Oh, when not protected by a shield, character's max HP will be. That's Lorge. That's Lorge. Oh. Ow. Stop pushing me! Lord! I don't have no. I have no energy because. The, the last scorpion died so fast. I'm not gonna use ult anymore. I think I can finish it off with Vayden instead. <gasps> Another purple. See? This is the luck I was talking about that I had the first time, and then it just disappeared. I don't know what happened. Thank you for the bless heels. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Todd. Thank you. Oh God, my Bennett is low. <laughs> what happened to my boy? He, he a low boy. Ooh. Come on, Bennett, kill her. Yeah, boy. Point, point. Oh no, I never um, applied shit. I never scrolled Pyro. It's bad, man. Wait, I do wonder though if Venti might do better in this team. What if I slap Venti on this? Uh, EM Animal EM. Okay. Good enough. I have two Viridescent sets since when? <laughs> Cause I know for a fact Kazuha also has EM animal EM. When the fuck did I get two EM sets? I don't understand. Yeah, chat is always going absolutely ballistics on ballistic on the bless yous. It's crazy. Oh my god, I don't wanna vlog this much, chat. Help! <laughs> Can you piggyback me? Genshin has no mounts, but maybe you can be my mount. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Wait, it's down? How far down? Wait, are we talking underground levels of down? <gasps> it is in the underground. Oh, it is. I know, I know where though. I know where. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Uh, can carry to the enemy? Yes. <laughs> Do that. It's right here. <gasps> and it's spoof mount! Yes! <gasps> Genius. Yeah, I feel like I still kind of need Raiden in my team. But maybe that's because every time I'm bursting, it didn't survive the burst yet. So maybe that's why. Anyway, I'm gonna open. Then we do this. Then we swirl. 
Let me do this. Oh no! No! I don't! No! The, the boss! Oh my god, that was such a bad ult! No! I kept getting sucked in by the other... Oh my... I hate these. Where are they? Are they dead? They are. That was so frustrating! How much HP is this? Point, point, point. What? What? Why am I got? No! Stop! I don't. What am I attacking? Give me a shell. Why did I go backwards? Shut help! I'm stupid. <laughs> Why backwards? Never backwards. Is he underground? I've never killed one over there before. Little auto aim. <laughs> oh no! Boink, 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 boink. We should play Genshin more often. I don't think people wanna watch Genshin. That's the biggest problem. Every time I tell, people don't care. <laughs> they watch when I'm pulling, and then once I'm done pulling, they're like, "Okay, this is boring now. Goodbye." And I'm like, "No, that's when the game starts." <laughs> Where did he go? Another month, another free message. XD one one. Let's go! Thank you. He's he's down there. Stop it! Stop it! Get your ass over here! I need my energy recharge. I hate this terrain so much. My my boy, can you not be at like the weirdest spot? Out. Oh. The damage of that. What the heck? Boink, 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 boink. Yeah, Genshin is cozy. Oh, I'm happy. I don't know. But some things just don't work out. Genshin, I feel like, only works when I'm pulling for stuff. So I play lots in my free time instead. Uh, same about WoW. I love WoW, but I can never stream it because people don't generally care a whole lot. God, I love this music so much. It's so good. Braid? Braid. Hello, Braid. Oh no, I didn't swirl. That is unfortunate, but it's okay. We have everything else out. Oh, See, all I need is proper terrain, dude. Wait, that's it already? No more? I'm telling you, there isn't enough of these stupid birds around. I did kill some earlier, though. Okay, maybe I'll have enough. I need... Weapon. Enhance. I need 27, so I need, I need 12 more. I should be able to grab 12, I think. With what I dropped. Uh, yes, maybe? Okay, if I prog... <laughs> Please prog... Please prog... Please prog twice! <laughs> Didn't drop... <laughs> Yikes... Alright, well... I'll... I'll manage, I guess. 
the weapon is decent for now. It's it's we we are making it work. We 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 are making it, unless someone wants to co-op real quick. If someone wants to co-op and give me their braids, that'd be great. Yeah, it's a yield server. It's a yield server. Just buy it from the shop. You know what? You're right. It should have shells, right? Yes. I need two. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Shy eyes, pum. <laughs> Shy eyes, pum. <laughs> Hold on, thank you. <laughs> yes, we're still streaming. Let's go. Let's upgrade this beauty. Max her out. How much extra attack do we get once we actually do max out the weapon? I wonder. I have tried interactive map, but I can't remember. My issue is going to be that I can't remember where I've already been to begin with, so. Oh, gosh. Okay, am I just... Blup, 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 blup. Oh wait, I can drag now! Oh my goodness, yes. <gasps> the dragging function. I love it. Seven months Wumpy Wumpy. Wumpy Wumpy. Oh, this is <gasps> this is amazing. Best feature ever added. Oh yes. Rip the map up. Oh, did I just... Oops. Oh, well. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. The Favarius weapons. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. I I could heal some more crit damage. That'd be great. But I absolutely hate min-maxing artifacts. Oh, what a pain. Months with stinky. Love Thank you! you. Love, love. Shy, love. Oh no! Anyway. Okay, um, I wanna change the language to English. Because I also want to do her story lane. Let's go. Oh. I've already unlocked it. Uh, should be... This one, Lion's Blood, right? Yes. <laughs> Study Lion! We're gonna do comfy story time. Rip free to play heads, I had. Listen, I spend just money on games. Always have, always will. <laughs> I enjoy the process. Gaming is my number one hobby. Also makes me spend less money on beauty products like makeup. Because a bottle of foundation is like 40 bucks. Okay, uh, I'm here. <laughs> what do I do inside here? Oh, on day! Oh, oh, it's nighttime. We have to... Okay, okay. It needs to be nighttime. Ah, uh, the daytime. Travel spine, right? Ground floor. Uh, it'll be fine. Maybe it still counts. Slump, slump. What if I go in now, though? But daytime. Ah, oh, shit! It was worth a try. Fuck. Oh, we should go down. Okay, let's see. Where down is it? Am I the only one who struggles to navigate these cities? How 
how much down the stage. We're going shopping? Oh, oh. What a mouth watering smell. She just sniffed on me. Smell the aroma of biryani anywhere. Let's go get some. Uh, we can still add it to the list. <laughs> well, Wait, why am I so bothered by that? That's a perfectly fine logic. If you go shopping and something ain't on the list, you get it anyway if you want it. What was wrong? Okay, I'd. I hate to defend Paimon, but she, uh, she did nothing wrong. She did nothing Oi. wrong. I, if you go shopping and something isn't on the shopping list, but you want it, you may as well add it. I, who cares? It sounds perfectly normal to me. Justice for Paimon. <laughs> she is the food. That was so unjustified. I listen. I'll bash on Paimon any chance I get, but but my girl did not deserve that one. <laughs> Hello there. Oh, it's been quite Daniel a while. Zard! Huh. So you two are still hanging out together. Yeah, didn't you say last time that you were gonna head back to the desert? Also, if I mispronounce names, I'm so sorry. I usually play on Japanese. <laughs> and um I don't okay, so I can't be the only one. So when when I when I read a story, I never in my head quite register the names of either places or people. When I read something in my head, I'm like, oh yeah, the two went together to the where they met who has then shown them all of their purchases done by they then had it back home to meet up with <laughs> back in the forest of <laughs> like I don't in my work in my head I don't really I recognize the names because of the way the word looks but I don't actually register what it's supposed to be pronounced I just read over it like <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, it's like selective blurriness, dude. I swear. Yeah, especially fantasy lore, cause the names are just wild. Wampo. I agree. The locations always have wild ass names. The characters have always wild ass names. <laughs> so I'm really bad at name pronunciation, cause in my head, I never pronounce a name ever. So today will be my first time pronouncing any names, pretty much. <laughs> I said I was going to resign from being her bodyguard. Not that our friendship was over. We're still the best of friends. Friends. The Halmayanis also still post jobs from time to time. <laughs> Their pay is always generous. So me and the other Mercs never pass them up. I told Dia to just stay at our place when she took one of those jobs a few days ago. My parents yes. were delighted. They even said that it always uh, felt like we were missing someone whenever Dia wasn't around. Her parents approve! <laughs> that sounds like something they would say, all right. They're always so welcoming. Anyway, the job is already taken care of, so I was gonna head back to the brigade as soon as I finished a little shopping. Mm -hmm. But the master kept insisting, and I ended up staying for another day. You can stay for as many days as you want, Dia. Oh, I bet she can! not around to treating you to his best dishes yet. Ah! You know I'm not the kind of person to stay put in one place like that, my lady. Look! She said they'll treat you to the best dishes! And I can't believe it! <laughs> Paimon has best. a point! The best dishes! How do you know? For once, I am siding once again with Paimon. But, but wait! Didn't you say last time that you would take me on a trip to the desert? Why don't you just take me with you today, when you leave? There are so many places I still haven't visited yet. The desert? She, she just got over her sickness. Is there a time skip or something? How, how large is the time skip ever since the death since her sickness got removed? Isn't, isn't it just been like a couple of days? Like a week or two maybe? <laughs> I don't know if she should take trips to the desert already. It's been four months! Oh, okay. Maybe that's different. I'm sorry, my lady, but no can do. 
There's still a few things I need to take care of back at the brigade. Oh. Besides, the desert hasn't exactly been the most peaceful place lately. Oh, come on. Not this again. That's also what you said last time and the time before that. That's because the desert will be dangerous. I know. I'm sorry. Just give me some more time. And I promise I'll plan the best trip ever for you. All right, fine. <gasps> to be perfectly honest, it's not that I wanted to go. It's more like I feel like something is off about you lately. Huh? Ever since you first set foot on the estate a few days ago, you've been acting anxious and even paranoid. Have you been delaying Can I your trip to because say you've run into some kind of trouble? Nah, are you kidding? You're worrying too much. Did you swear on that? Friends shouldn't uh, lie to each other, you know. Is she gonna swear? Don't pry any further if you're willing to swear on what you just said. But if something really is bothering you, then just tell me. You know I'll help you however I can. Mm. She is right. Oh, looks like Junior Zab was onto something. You're too perceptive, my lady. Seems I can't hide anything from you. I just thought that nothing good could come out of telling you about the messy happenings of mercenaries. Knowing too much only leads to more trouble. Uh? Mercenary life is a dog-eat-dog -dog world. Doggy dog. Supreme. Everything operates on a completely different set of rules. That doesn't change anything about what I just said, though. We're still friends, and I can only support you if I understand what's bothering you. My she lady, has a plan. You're not gonna stop until you drag it out of me, are ya? All right, I'll share what <laughs> I know. Let's go somewhere else first. This isn't exactly the best place for a discussion. <laughs> For a second, let's go somewhere else first because she doesn't want me listening in on a conversation. I was like, Daya, ain't no fucking way. <laughs> okay. I was like, nah. Let's talk here. Just try not to draw any extra attention. As you may already know, the Aramites have both a lot of mercenaries and a complex organizational structure. Many mercs are no different than me. Just going around looking for jobs to earn some more. Okay. My brigade is called the Blazing Beasts. We're not a large group, but every member is loyal and brave. However, not all Aramite brigades are like mine. Some are willing to cross all kinds of lines for the sake of Mora. The most notorious is a faction known as Deshret's Relics. I, you know what? That's that's what I would be in. I'll I'll be like, that's too bad. I'll <laughs> starve my Mora now. <laughs> Deshret's Relics. And we all have incredible hair. <laughs> You got it. I've heard that you've already crossed paths with Ain al Akmar. They're one of the groups under the Relic's banner. God, some of these names resonate in my brain for the first time and I just can't believe. I, <laughs> every time I see a name like this in my head, I would just, I would just read it as like, uh uh uh. Okay, uh uh uh. Mm -hmm. he, he, he is a member of. Mm -hmm. Oh, you mean the group that tried to sell us the Divine Knowledge Capsule? Yeah, they weren't friendly at all. Deshret's relics is composed of many smaller brigades like Ain al Akmar. Uh, uh, uh. The relics headquarters issues orders to all brigades under his control. On any other day, I would want nothing to do with them. Unfortunately, though, the brigade that's stirring up trouble now is none other than Dakan al Akmar. Ah, uh, D A A. Dakan? Ah, I think it means beard or something. Believe me, it's a really stupid Beard, uh, name. Uh. I found it insufferable for years. Anyway, the real issue is that Dakan al Akmar is led by my father, mm. Usayla. Wait, huh? Say what now? Wait, huh? I think I'm starting to understand your anxiety now. But what did they do? Poppy? <laughs> I won't go into details, my lady. But they've been involved in a lot of violent incidents. We're talking hundreds. It just means red, by the way. Ooh, oh, how fitting, though. Hundreds? Yep. The scenes tend to be quite gruesome, too. They strip the victims of all their valuables before murdering them. Oh. <laughs> that is not what I thought the sentence was gonna be. I... <laughs> Cha, I don't think I have to... <laughs> Stop! Okay, Genshin is not that dark. Okay. Not only have they targeted merchant caravans and ordinary citizens, 
but other mercenary brigades as well. That's beyond terrible. They won't even spare their own kind. I don't know how Deshret's relic sees it. Uh -huh. All I do know is that Dakana Akmar has become more and more aggressive over the last few years. If I don't do something about them, then even my brigade or the people of Aru Village could become their next target. I just wish I knew what's going on to do this. Yeah. How can your father do such terrible things? I don't know. People change. He's always been pretty pathetic. <laughs> But at least in the past, there were still a few lines that he wouldn't cross. <laughs> She's like the girl's name. Pathetic. <laughs> That's setting the bar pretty Pathetic. Well. I mean, if he was even remotely decent, then why would I have to leave the brigade and cut all ties with him? He was loud and foolish, with no real sense of purpose. Damn. Instead of doing anything useful, he spent most of his time drinking and chasing after women. <laughs> Damn. Of course, the other brigade members were just like him. Their ruckus would go on night after night. They are. Stop. <laughs> they are. We can hear you. <laughs> she walked off so she can rip a loud one, but <laughs> she didn't walk nearly far enough. <laughs> she got a little unfamiliar with the concept of stealth. Sounds like a nightmare. What about your mother? Did she ever step Oh, right, that's a mother, too. What happened to her? Unfortunately, I never knew my mother. Oh, how convenient. Uh, oh, um, I'm sorry, Dia. I, I didn't know. It's all right, my lady. That's pretty common in mercenary circles. Didn't I mention that my father was chasing after women? I was the result of one of those encounters with uh, some random person. Uh oh. <laughs> Yikes. Wait, okay, but as a mercenary, if you're chasing after women, why would you then take in the child? Because chances are the mercenary just moves on, and whoever got, um, hmm, seated then grows the child, and they just have to keep it, because, you know, why would the dad take the child? That's weird. He told me that he wasn't sure who my mother was, and in any case, he never came to see me. He'd say... You'll be fine as long as you remember to stick with dad. But even then, he left most of the parenting to the brigade. The one thing I do remember is that he used to tell me stories. More fighters? But it's a female though. In like a in like a real life scenario, if you have a brigade, sure, if you know you're getting a son, maybe, but Oh, maybe just cheap labor. Maybe she was just like, I'm not implying females can't fight. I'm implying that biologically they simply have, I don't know what it is, le le less of muscle density. I don't know how it works. So I guess they just, they expected her to like, you the know. The problem was that he had terrible taste. He only knew a few stories and even those tended to be pretty stale. They were tales of desert warriors defeating dragons in the forest. Or stories of mercenaries rescuing princesses from rebel armies. Come down to it, I will hear you. This, in my opinion, it's just historical facts. I don't. I, I, <laughs> Sounds like your typical fairy tales. More or less, yeah. Even worse. Oh no. Maybe the first or second. Historical time facts. Around, but after about twenty repeats, it started to get a little dull. He seemed to think those stories were the best things ever, though. He was so into them that he'd call the whole brigade over and make them perform the whole thing as a play. <laughs> Those are kind of cute, though, I'm gonna be honest. Even the toys he gave me would all be story props. I'd get helmets, shields, and toy swords. It was only much later when I realized that the shows were more for him than they ever were for me. What an interesting guy. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I can blame him. Because, okay, so if you have a child, you will do whatever you think they might find interesting that is within your interest, right? Only as they grow older and develop their own interests, you would know that it never was their interest, right? So I don't really think I can complain. I'll do. I mean, a, a child can't, you know, it's a child. 
Yeah, I've always found him pretty childish. That was something I could just shrug off. I yeah, he no tried. I feel like she she undervalues that at least he tried. Like, yeah, maybe it was his interest, but like he's gotta start somewhere. You know, if she never expresses that she doesn't give a shit about the stars, then how's he supposed to know? She's just being edgy. <laughs> Until I grew up and learned the true face of Deshret's relics for myself. Looting, blackmail, violence, and fraud. They not only accepted such heinous acts, they would even openly boast about them. No one in the brigade was any kind of hero. Instead, my father and his cronies were more like the bad guys oh. that needed to be taken down. Um, we are very close right now. I'm sorry, I cannot concentrate. A <laughs> girl! <laughs> that dramatic zoo! <laughs> I'm sorry, but that is very close. I don't know. Don't ask me the color of anything. <laughs> you zone out. Is it too quiet? Should I should I up the dialogue volume? Do you, should I make it louder? Is it is it too silent? <laughs> I can't adjust the volume after this. Did they really think that as long as they didn't do any of that stuff right in front of me, I would never know? I'll I'll, I'll make it a little louder. Yeah 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 yeah. I think I can understand your feelings. The difference between perception and reality must have hit hard. Oh, uh. Yeah, but don't worry, my lady. It's all water under the bridge to me now. I had a huge argument with my father and left that place behind for good. I'm not investigating them due to any bitter feelings I still have towards my father. Of course I just not. want to protect those that are close Yes, to me. of course it's not the bitter feelings towards the father. Yeah. I told the boys to gather as much information as they could. Most of the reports concern violent incidents. Yo, Santi, There's also inside some talk of primals smuggling. At the, uh, or whatever you're saving them for. I see. But isn't this investigation incredibly dangerous? Dunya Zat, her entire job is dangerous. That's... It's, it's literally that... <laughs> I I don't want to be the one to point this out, Dunya Zad, but that's a little... She, her, her entire living situation is dangerous. I, <laughs> that's a little what she does for a living! You even hired her for that! It is, but every mercenary lives life on the edge. Thank you! It's a lifestyle that I enjoy. Yeah, th thanks for pointing out the obvious. <laughs> that may be true, but it'll be impossible for those who care about you not to worry. <laughs> She has scripted that way, Dunya Zad. You don't understand. Well, now you get why I didn't want to share any of this with you. What should we do? They both have valid concerns. I guess you're following the end of the desert. Uh, but there's no need for you to get caught up in this mess, too. Why? Well, she's super tough, so if she went into the desert with you, then Paimon bets the problem will be solved in no time. <sighs> I'm inclined to agree. I'd feel a lot more at ease if you took her along to help. Thank you. I'll wait for news from you in the city until then. Please, stay safe. Yeah, she, and I cut Dunya's eye. Literally, indeed, hired her to be a meat shield. And then goes, oh no, uh, Dea, isn't your profession dangerous? Uh, Dunya, you, you hired the meat shield. That, that's how you met. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> <laughs> I'm honored that you care so much for me, my lady. All right, then let's get moving. Our first stop will be Caravan Rebot, where we can catch up a bit with my fellow Mercs. Yes. Is the water wet? <laughs> All right, let's go. Um, let me work on the volume. Uh, I'll audio. Paimon, coming in. Paimon, coming in. This should help a lot when it comes to just like enjoying the dialogues. Uh, where are we? Here. Why here? She's like Captain Obvious. No, that's Paimon. Hey, dear, you're back. <laughs> are these two friends of yours? Is the volume better? Or do you want it to be louder? Oh, <laughs> so you've already become like one of us then. 
<laughs> uh, well, that's good to know. Anyway, uh, since we've got a newcomer, let me fill you in on what the Khan al akmar has been up to lately. They've become extremely <laughs> aggressive. Apparently, even their own now have become acceptable targets. They even attack other relics brigades, just the uh, same as any other mercenary brigade. A little louder. I... Even the most ferocious beasts still protect their own. It sounds like they've thrown that straight to the wind. <sighs> That's right. Damn, they have so Etsy. Once they've enough loot off the other mercenaries, they sell it off to a different brigade, or, or turn to merchants on the black market. Uh. A portion of their profits is immediately exchanged for more food and weaponry to be used in their next violent operation. That's terrible! Is this game even fun? My guy, it's literally a free-to-play game. Download it, figure it out. It's free to play. What's what's the what's the hold back here? Just see if you like it. It's free. Yeah, and it really makes you wonder why they're so desperate for Mora. A few days ago, Isham and I trailed them for a while, and even disguised ourselves as merchants to conduct trade with them. We were able to learn a few things from the exchange. <laughs> she needs a spa day, like chill, girl. <laughs> Rather than saying they're out to plunder and hoard Mora. It'd probably be more accurate to say that they're experiencing an internal power struggle. Wait, okay. a power struggle? You heard me right. The vast majority of their victims are mercenaries from the other brigades of Deshret's relics. Mm -hmm. If their only goal was Mora, they could have gone after anybody. The targeted nature of their attacks points to a power struggle between the different brigades within the relics. That's the only plausible explanation we have. Unfortunately, we weren't able to find out anything more specific. It seems they're also trying to keep things under wraps. <laughs> no shit, I... You think so? That... that you, you think they're trying to keep it the secret? <laughs> oh, one last thing we discovered was that over the past few years, as the Khan al Ahmar became more and more active, Deshret's relics as a whole became a lot weaker. Okay. Well. Hmm, sounds mighty strange to me too. Arun, you can leave the rest of the investigation to us. This game down to the main story, I guess. Gotta say, though, I didn't expect you to go on a whole undercover mission during the few days I was gone. Sounds like you were really putting your necks on the line, no? <sighs> nah, it was nothing. We're just as concerned about the situation as you are. The Khan al Ahmar is your father's crew, after all. Okay, but why, do, why is Harun just flexing his abs, though? I... <laughs> He is fully covered from head to toe, but he needs those abs showing. <laughs> Harun knows that he is packing and he ain't, he ain't, I would. If I looked like Harun, you, you bet your ass I would. Harun knows what he's got going on. He ripped. <laughs> he's got him, gotta show him. He's got the ab window. I <laughs> gotta advertise the business. <laughs> I would too, of course. <laughs> What he said. Besides, Dia, haven't you done more dangerous things than all of us combined? <laughs> what we did is nothing compared to your experiences. Why does she just stand there in this cutscene like the man standing emoji? <laughs> look at, look at Dia just standing there. <laughs> saying what you say? <laughs> well. Yeah. And while they went to talk with Dakan Al Akmar, I took a look at the last camp they attacked. Any survivors of the attack were already long gone. There was nothing of value left in the camp. Ah, Hisham and Kalaf. You're here too. What up? We rushed over as soon as we saw you come into Caravan Reebok. Nice to meet you, ab bo abs boys. <laughs> Although this new friend of yours looks a little green behind the ears, I'm sensing a special green? vibe from her. I, sir, there, there, there's many colors that are very prominent and many on my outfit but, but but green isn't really the most used one i would say now that we know you'll have a capable partner with you we can also rest easy hey what about paimon feel anything special oh, <laughs> paimon, please. oh uh you're also planning to tag along with them yeah tell them paimon of course paimon is the traveler's most important guy uh, she goes paimon will follow unfortunately yes oh in that case <laughs> Then you'd better take care of her too, Dia. Uh, don't underestimate Paimon! <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about her. She may look tiny and helpless, but she's been through just as many battles as the Traveler here. Has she? Has she been? 
I don't remember Paimon being there in most of the farming I do. I don't know, man. I d <laughs> she just kind of stands there. <laughs> Even if she had only survived on sheer luck, then that alone yes. would still make her quite formidable. <laughs> Paimon's fucking fails. It's like... Why? Why are you talking? <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea. I guess I shouldn't judge by appearances. <laughs> Oh, one other thing, Dia. When you're free, why don't you update the deputy about your upcoming schedule? We held another recruitment event a few days ago, but everyone only came to see the flame main. You weren't around at the time, so people were pretty disappointed to only find our crew of rough, unkempt guys. Guys. <laughs> rough, unkempt guys. <laughs> He remembered for a second that he didn't, um... <laughs> the deputy put a lot of effort into the event, but it was basically for nothing. Only a few people chose to stay, and that really got to him. Ah, uh, sorry to hear that. <laughs> I'll be sure to bring him some great liquor next time. God. I left in a hurry, and I couldn't make it back in time for the event. Oh yeah, he's very happy to be in involved in all of this with all the guys. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta admit, I can understand their disappointment, though. You're our brigade's main selling point, after all. Uh, well, I, I, I wanna bet that your colleague over there um, has a different opinion. He, um... <laughs> uh, he has got a whole different selling point. I, I, don't, I just don't think... Guys... <laughs> now, if only the deputy could figure out a way to bring a few more smoking hot members into our ranks... <laughs> I'm not hot. <laughs> Shy I guess puppy. he doesn't like me like that. <laughs> <laughs> Keep dreaming. Remember the last time I invited a couple gals into the brigade? See, that's you the problem. Froze up with your gals. Gaping, like a bunch of scarecrows. <laughs> See, that's... They are, I don't, I'm not sure you realize that's exactly the problem. You shouldn't have brought gals. It should have been guys. The awkward silence and weird expressions left quite the impression on them. <laughs> they were originally interested in joining us, but after that, they both told me they were too uncomfortable to stick around. Because they saw Dea. They weren't blind. Hey, didn't we agree to never bring that up again? <laughs> oh, my man is embarrassed. Huh? Wait, are you serious? Why have I never heard about this? Uh, Caleb, no one invited you for very obvious reasons. I, <laughs> I don't think you are part of the brigade yet. Oh. <laughs> are you kidding me? I missed a once in a lifetime moment like that and you weren't even gonna tell me? Rejected? <laughs> All, right. All right. We can tell you about it later. Now's not the time. They really missed the opportunity to follow up the sentence with Now's not the time. Come. Hey, don't you try to change the subject. You and Hisham get your butts over here and tell me everything right now. Oh, I bet you like that! <laughs> uh, are they always like this? <laughs> <laughs> More or less. <laughs> there aren't many rules or graces when it comes to mercenaries. If someone oh, starts getting out I'm of your sorry, skin, I'm sorry, I space right back at him. If that doesn't put an end to it, eh, then you just challenge him to a fight. But we also don't tend to oh, take I many bet things love too the seriously. Rest. Why are they running? Being direct and getting it all out of uh, your system as soon as things huh? come up is better than keeping everything bottled up, never talking about it. What? The... Huh? The... <laughs> They're just zooming! That's also why I never spare their feelings when I talk to them. I want to laugh, I'll laugh. If I'm angry, then I'll unload on them. It's hard to stop once you get used to it. Though, I can never do that when I'm with the homiyanis. Homiyanis. <clears throat> hey, knuckleheads, can you at least tell me the rest of the intel before you go back to your bickering? Oh, I wish you would have called them boogers. <laughs> yeah, you hear her haul off? Daddy and Told Daddy were just wrestling. The <laughs> They're just wrestling, <laughs> fighting it out. <laughs> I drew up a map. <laughs> the right homie here is the spot. 
There you'll find the merchant caravan responsible for getting rid of Dukan al Ahmar's looted goods. All right. All you gotta do is wait and ambush them in oh, the no. evening. Oh no, stealth have mission. No idea what hit them. Perfect. Thanks for that. Be sure to pass my regards to everyone else in the brigade as well. Will do. You stay safe, Dia. <laughs> oh, Miyani. <laughs> ah! Wait, it's over here. Damn. I was gonna be in a desert. All right, ambush. This should be the place. Let's find a spot to hide and bide our time. Where are we hiding? I want to see. It's gonna come see. down to a fight one way or another. That so isn't very hidden, Daya. It's, I don't know about you, but we are hiding in plain sight. Is that the plan? We are literally just standing in <laughs> not even tall grass. No need to worry. She knows her way around a fight. <laughs> I'm not worried about that. What I meant is that we probably shouldn't go too hard on the enemy. After all, we still need to get information out of them. <laughs> the best way to hide man standing emoji. Gosh, how long are we waiting? Here they come. <laughs> you ready? Yes. Kronos, thank you so much. Let's not give them a chance to react and end this quickly. Mm-hmm. Let's go! That's close enough. Goodbye. Teamwork is Goodbye. teamwork. Goodbye. Huh? Time for takeoff. Oh, I'm gonna watch your stream until it finally releases one more. Oh, you're dead! What happened? Let's light it up! Ow. Gloves off! Was that it? I'm crouching! <laughs> <coughs> You're the flame main. <laughs> Good. That saves me an introduction. All right. Time for a little talk. Are you buddies with Dakana Lakmar now? Tell me, what are they after? <laughs> you know the code of being a mercenary just like everyone else. The first rule is to never divulge key information about our employer. What makes you think I talk? These fists! <laughs> that might have worked on an amateur. But I know you're just looking to protect your reputation. Think about it, though. What's your reputation worth if you won't have the other tools you need to succeed in this line of work? Tools like, I don't know, your limbs or eyes? Uh, 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 Daya, are you okay? Damn, she... <laughs> she <laughs> Damn! You've got five seconds. You might want to think twice about how much your employer's Me, information is worth to you. Sorry, right, Paimon. <laughs> I'm not joking around. We're gonna feast we can tonight. Do this the easy way or the painful way. Two seconds. I'll save you the trouble. Huh? What? Huh? Are you crazy? <sighs> he tried to bite off his own tongue. Quick, search the area for any first aid supplies. He bit off his tongue. <laughs> <sighs> I definitely didn't expect him to go that far. Thankfully, the wound wasn't too deep, and he just passed out from the pain. But okay. why would he be so extreme? Uh, I just wanted to test his mettle. You can get a lot of mercenaries to talk just by threatening them. I didn't expect him to be willing to go through so much pain just to deny us some intel. Well, now you know. He ripped the big one. <laughs> well, he's out cold for now. We could wait for him to wake up, but maybe it's not a good idea to interrogate him any further. What should we do? Yeah, why, don't worry why not? about it. It'll be a waste of time to interrogate him again after that. He might just hurt himself again if we start asking. Why? I'd... 
Why do we care if he bites off his tongue? He can still write. Right? He can still not. We can ask him yes or no questions and he has to not. There are lots Lily? of goods around here. Let's what? search the area. Maybe we'll be able to find something. Bleed out though? Well, that's unfortunate because we are going to make sure he doesn't. Right? <sighs> I'm really sorry. Hi, Lily. I have a question. What do I need to do for you? Do you make a collab with small Russian VTuber, who just today re-debuted on Twitch? I would I <laughs> I don't- I I don't collab a whole lot, and I- There's nothing other people can do. I collab with people I'm friends with, not because- I don't just collab with people because they're like, Oh, oh, VTuber, yes, collab. No, I, I collab because I, I like them. And I know them. I don't- I don't just go- Hey, let's let let's collect all collabs like Pokemon. Let's just one after another. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> Who cares? All right, next one. Bye. My people are used to the desert life, but still, I hope that one day they'll be able to find an oasis of their own and leave the sandstorm. Hi, Lily. How was your right. week? Here's I NJ. hope you win the stream Talk. reward. Also, have you ever been to Europe? Uh, one can say I've been in, in, in Europe once or twice. I've, I've been a, in Europe a little bit. Uh, here and there, you know. <laughs> just, uh, just, just a little here and there. Alright, food and water. Makes sense. Weapons. That also makes sense. What's in here? You found a piece of paper with a bunch of names on it. Maybe it's a Nails. record of something. Let me take a look. If this really is a merchant caravan, yeah, I've dabbled they in should Europe. have a record of their transactions. Hmm. Yep. I see an hey. entry for Dakana Lakmar right here. <laughs> yep. Kusela, Idrisi, Bashar, and Tikriti. I don't know why I thought she was gonna be the meme of like, mm, yep, that's a piece of paper I can't read. <laughs> All familiar names. The Kana Lakmar has been trading for a hefty supply of food, weapons, and medicine. It seems that in the past, they used to receive some canned knowledge as well. This caravan is just one link in their logistics chain. Once in the rainforest, the caravan will exchange the looted goods for Mora, and the funds will then be passed to a specific person. That person will then pack okay. the caravan full of necessary goods, which will then be brought right back to Dakana Lakmar. Okay. Wait, why is there no Mora value recorded for the final transaction? Hmm? No value? Yeah. Every transaction before the last one was marked with an exact amount of Mora. But the final one, where they paid for everything to be brought back to the desert, was simply marked as delivered. Because... Uh, I don't know. Hmm, perhaps. But they couldn't have known how much they would make off selling the loot. Do they not care about profit margins at all? Anyway, the next Maybe parts they the were paid the in different themselves. ways. There are a lot of entries. Everything was probably sourced from the rainforest. Huh? What's wrong? Shazaman Homayani? <laughs> surprised to find someone with the exact same first and last name. Shazaman Homayani is Dunyar Zad's father and the head of the Homayani family. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> has no business being that attractive. <laughs> she does not. <laughs> Chad, I'm so sorry. Oh, 
Ich going on here <sighs> I'm sorry you're right I'll consider what we found and not jump to conclusions just yet yes let's not assume that Tony Hazard's family <laughs> is doing shady business just because you can't believe it but what this piece of paper confirms is that the Homiyani <laughs> family has been providing goods to Dakana Lakmar <laughs> Talking about the homie Yamizakis. <laughs> like it's the contrast of Dea being like this complete edgelord, <laughs> and then the word homie Yanni just slips off her tongue, like it's no big deal. <laughs> That's a possibility, but if that was the case, why is this caravan specifically named Shazaman as the person of contact? <laughs> <laughs> they could have just as easily bought goods such as food and medicine directly from Caravan Rebot or Port Ormos. Mm -hmm. <sighs> if the Shazam was actually aware of this, then perhaps he's been supplying the brigade's operations the entire time! Yeah. funding violence and looting. The brigade gets the goods, and he is paid the proceeds from the sale of the loot. <laughs> Shazam, man! <laughs> Stop! Wow, old homie Yanni. <laughs> oh my god. What? Why would he do something like this? It's not like the homie Yanni is in need of money. <laughs> homie always needs money. <laughs> I honestly have no idea. Stop! I've been to their estate many times and I've never <sighs> noticed anything suspicious. <sighs> The only potentially large expenditure I could think of would be the treatment cost for Dunyar Zad's Elazar. Maybe Ooh. they borrowed a lot of Mora in the past? They probably did. That makes sense. <laughs> and they're having such an important conversation. <laughs> and I can't stop laughing. Fuck. But that's still just a speculation. I don't think the master would stoop so low to make Mora. So I need to make you two friends. Hard task, but I'll try my best. Here is her name, Froggy Tyan. She was on you before. <laughs> You're Thanks. probably right. I know my lady's personality, and she wouldn't deliberately keep something like this from us. Whew. What? She wouldn't. What should we do now? She probably just doesn't know. It's another mystery. Why, why would Donya Zat know? Like, if her parents did something shady, they wouldn't tell her anyway. So, of course, she didn't know. Hmm. If you ask me. We already have no choice but to confront her about this. <laughs> I can't unsee the fucking Peppa emoji of... <laughs> I'm not worried. It's too early to make a verdict yet. I still have faith in the Homayanas. <laughs> Let's go find my lady again. We'll tell her everything. Why do they I have to say it to every second point. sentence too? <laughs> if we're lucky, we can not only figure out the mystery of this paper, mm -hmm. but also follow the trail of breadcrumbs to the people responsible at Dakana Lakma. Oh, thank you. Uh, Thea, are you sure this is the best decision? What if instead? Getting the help we need, we just end up revealing everything we've discovered to the enemy. Why would that help? What? I've considered that possibility. How would that be a 
possibility. I want to tell her what we found. I think I owe her that much. True friendship is built on Wait. trust. Wait, uh, uh, right. Uh, teach me real quick. Why would the? How is it a possibility to real real everything to the enemy? I. Aren't they just gonna check if if the Shazam man actually is part of this? If they've been knowingly dealing with them, or if that's just something that's behind their backs. Huh? Oh, in case the homie yummies are sus. Ah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. She showed genuine concern for me when we first brought up the topic. I can't repay her kindness with doubt and suspicion. <clears throat> homie yummies. <laughs> That's not how I deal with people. You're right. Hyman wants to trust Junior's IQ. I mean, I don't think she knows anything. Even if, like I said, even if there are sirs, clearly she wouldn't know. That'd be stupid for her to know. Yeah. Let's pay another visit to Sumeru City. But that wouldn't make sense. If the, okay, if the parents, <clears throat> if Shazam Man and Homiyami had shady business going on, why would they tell Dunyazard? It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Dunyard said, don't. <laughs> like, that would just be one more person that knows too much and has the potential of screwing over the mission. I, it doesn't make sense. Also, let me change my wings. It just, it just would not make sense. Uh, like, like, obviously they wouldn't tell her. We're back, my lady. Oh, you're back a lot sooner than I expected. You mustn't have run into any trouble then. Well, <clears throat> how did it go? Uh, what did you come up with? Actually, we are still investigating. It's just that we've discovered something strange. I see. The clues you found have led you back here, in the city? I don't know, head empty day of fruity. What the fuck does that even mean? <laughs> what else that mean? <laughs> Something like that. Yeah. <clears throat> you all look a little dispirited. Whatever you found must not have been very encouraging after all. Oh, Dunya Zart, you have no idea. <laughs> Buckle up. Why don't you discuss it with me? Oh, yes, you will. Maybe I'll be able to say something to cheer you up. Oh, I don't think so. It's okay, my lady. Huh? It's not so much about me being upset with my father or anything Daya? like that. <sighs> How should I put this? So something is wrong. Even the Traveler and Paimon have been uncharacteristically quiet. I literally never talk. What do you mean? On any other day, Paimon would have already waved to me with a smile and shouted, Junior's odd, we're back! You know what? Fair. Yes. That's a Paimon thing. <sighs> so tell me, what happened? Uh, <clears throat> well? My lady, please prepare yourself for what we're going to tell you next. It concerns the Master. The Master? You mean, my father? Is there another master? <laughs> okay, I understand. Don't worry about me. I'll listen as attentively as I can. All right. The master of masters. My father has been supplying goods to Dakan al Akmar. Well, we don't know that for sure yet, but it's a strong speculation based on information found, but it could have been something that's been done unknowingly. Yeah, it makes as little sense to us as it does to you. I've never doubted the Master's integrity, so I'm having a real hard time rationalizing how he could ever support an infamous brigade like them. Maybe he's not actually aware of the full story, and just Maybe. stumbled into the deal by accident. Or he has been paying for your probably very expensive medical treatment by dealing with shady stuff behind the scenes. I can't help but agree with the traveler. <clears throat> Yali! What up, your red? Hello! Oh, goodness. We, we're, we're doing Genshon. Um... 
which might be spoilery because I'm uh, I'm I'm doing uh, the new character storyline, so uh, buckle up. This 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 is not spoiler free. <laughs> what up? How was stream, dude? I did you guys know that Lee loves Genshin? I he he is he is a Genshin fan. Like he loves it. He loves it. I'm just not sure why his entire team uh, is only full of men. I don't know why. I don't. Every time I ask him, he is he, he is like, oh, I just they they're just strong, but but they're not. He always refuses to like put females into his team for some reason. I don't understand why. <laughs> Boys are cute. They are. <laughs> Wait, he loves Genshin. You should ask him about it. <laughs> Welcome home, yummies. It's gonna be different. <laughs> Your voice is Paimon in Genshin. <laughs> oh shit. Um, he he did for a brief time, yes, but his voice was too high pitched, so they had to recast, um, to a different Paimon later on. Mm -hmm. So if you've ever noticed how how Paimon sounds different throughout Genshin, that's because um, yeah, he was just uh, his voice was too high for Paimon, you know. Mm hmm What makes a homie yummy? <laughs> yeah, we needed a deeper voice, Paimon. Huh? You mean you feel the same way, Junior Zod? Paimon, how could you not? Thank you for sharing all this information with me. Okay, um, so... If you don't know what's going on, uh, first of all, spoilers ahead. Um, if, if you don't want to be spoiled in the storyline because you aren't this far yet, um... <coughs> I must kindly ask you to leave, for I'm about to summarize what the fuck happens. Um, long story short, very short, incredibly short, in one, two, three, four, five. Hi. Spoilers. What about Tilo! your Paimon expression? Paimon's not emergency food! I've been super sicky the last few days. <clears throat> Can I oh. have healing Sniffy's shy cry? Of course! Also, Tilo, thank you! For the tier three, <laughs> <clears throat> but uh, basically, this character right here is called Daya. That's Dunya Zard. That is emergency food. Uh, I've we been just a bad found out and haven't interacted much recently. But oh I'm my happy god, to no. be subbed and supporting for a year now. Shy, you love. <laughs> sure, thank you for the tier three one anniversary. Fuck. <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you. <clears throat> Uh, long story short, um, she is the mercenary of this person. Uh, this person was very sick just a while ago until we once again saved the world and her sickness disappeared. Alongside that, as a side effect. Um, now I just found out that um, the person that we've been trying to investigate that uh, is connected to some uh, shady mercenary... Brigade stuff may be connected to her father. Since you've told me everything you know, I should also tell you about also their best friends. I've been harboring for quite a while. <clears throat> oh, and she may confess right now. Oh gosh. In the past, I thought that my father oh, never hired mind. a bodyguard Hello. for me, so how are you? That I wouldn't run away and get ne lost. Ne never mind. I, <laughs> I, I, I didn't read the room right. <laughs> my bad. However. There are plenty of capable mercenaries in the core of 30. Why did my father go out of his way to hire Dia? Uh, about that. Well, the Homiyanis really needed bodyguards, <laughs> so they reached out to the Blazing Beasts. <laughs> and, and also there's Homi... <laughs> there's Homiyanis. There... <laughs> yes, ho the Homiyanis, that, that's a group of people. Later, the master told me that I was one of the best mercenaries he'd ever seen, and that I should stick around to become one of his bodyguards. He offered me a pile of mora, so I just signed on. Well, but that didn't really answer my question. Just think about it. Why did my father specifically reach out to the Blazing Beasts? <laughs> oh, bodyguards! I lost the body parts, and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh, just some body part business. <laughs> my dad hired you to be my body part. 
Uh, maybe the core of 30 just didn't have anyone available, or maybe someone recommended us. I've never given it too much thought. I think I get what you're saying. You think none of this was a coincidence. <laughs> nothing seems strange or out of place but there are many parts of the story that don't actually make any sense like what if my father had always been in contact <clears throat> with the Khan al Akmar, then it would make sense for him to bring Dia into her house you mean the goal all along was to get Dia to be your bodyguard no 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 that's too much of a stretch I cut all ties with my father a long time ago he has no control over my life anymore. Unless... But that still doesn't rule out the possibility that your father has still been trying to influence your life without you knowing. Hmm. So, the Master was not likely an innocent victim in all of this? Sorry we put all this on you so suddenly, Junior Zod. It's okay, Paimon. I should actually be thanking you. I mean, uh, would you rather we hide the truth? Regardless of his reasons, if my father has truly been funding a violent group of mercenaries, then it's my duty to bring him back to reason. But Chen, he had side boobs, though, ain't no way. But is that <clears throat> really the right thing to do? My father has committed many atrocities and deserves all the punishment that he has coming to it's him. It's been nine well, months. Zero sympathy Love for you, Lily. Thank you! You may call you. me an ungrateful child, but my feelings will remain the same. However, the Homiyani family has treated me with nothing but generosity and kindness. If we decide to investigate this further, we could end up implicating the entire Homiyani family. I would be biting the hand that's fed me over all these years. <laughs> Not the homies! You can't betray the homies! Dia... It's alright, Dia. If anyone were to ask, you could always just say that I'm the one who instructed you to get to the bottom of this. You don't have to do that, my lady. I'm not conflicted because I'm afraid of taking responsibility. Besides, you're the one we should all be worried about. Hey! It's oh, super sorry. early to give up hope! Uh, what was that thing about friendship again? I, my thumb is resting on space bar and sometimes it gets very heavy. Right, yeah, true! Before we've confirmed all the facts. Thank you, everyone. That makes a lot of sense. I guess I should always remember the trust that I've placed in people. <laughs> How does Paimon solve the situation with, like, friendship and trust? I, <laughs> why, why would that make anyone feel better? <laughs> in which case, my lady, could you ask the master to come out and have a chat with us? Sure thing. Oh. I also hope he'll be able to give us a logical explanation. Let's meet at the usual place then. All right. A uh, usual place? Th their place, their private usual place. Wait, in the, in the open, just just in the middle of everything. That that's your place. Thank Ain't you for way. coming, sir. Please allow me sir? to introduce these two. Oh. This oh, is the I traveler, thought... <laughs> and next to her is her travel companion, Paimon. I thought it was him talking! I was like... <laughs> he called me sir! I was like, huh? Ah, yes. My daughter has mentioned them from time to time. It's a privilege to finally meet them in person. Sir? But we may skip all the pleasantries for now. What is the important matter you wish to discuss with me today? Well... She wanted to bring man. this transaction record to your attention. There's something on this record that we're all pretty curious about. <laughs> Dea explains to Shazam so man. that's what you found? Huh. Seems like I can't keep everything from you much longer. So you wa- <gasps> If you wouldn't mind, we'd like an explanation. No! Shazam man evil? Well... 
It's a long and difficult story. We have plenty of time. To be time. perfectly honest, I'm not sure if I'm doing the right thing. Uh, in fact, we get paid tonight just literally listening to your thing. So go ahead. <laughs> what I do know, though, dear, is that the truth will bring you no solace. If anything, it will likely cause you a great amount of anguish. Anguish. Wait, me? Yes. So it I does understand involve perfectly her dad. why you came to see me. And I am touched by your collective commitment to do the right thing. But knowledge always comes at a price. And sometimes, as they say, ignorance is bliss. Your father, Kusela, and I both believed that. So, uh, the, here it comes! Of course, you have the right to seek and learn the truth, but I must warn you. I voted for you. Ah, Ezreal, thank you! Thank you very much. I, it means the world to me. Thank you, thank you. Bless. The facts of this matter may reduce everything you've built for yourself into sand, blowing in the wind. Ah. Uh, th that harsh? Really? <laughs> Spill it, Shazam, man! If you must proceed, then Kusela's heartfelt efforts will also fade into the wind like a fleeting mirage. His heartfelt efforts? I, I'm sorry, sir, but I'm not sure I follow. I've made it this far in life without a single drop of my father's support. I, and that's where you're wrong! I have my own ideals and ways of looking at the world, as well as people and causes that I've chosen to cherish and fight for. None of these things have anything to do with him. I told you her father ain't all that bad. She was just an edgy teen that didn't get past her edgy teen I hate my parents phase. And then dad still looked out. I came here today to support you as the head of the Homiyani family. <laughs> Stop. No warning will change my stance on that. <laughs> <sighs> I understand. Then let me tell you a little story. Let me tell you a story, child, <laughs> of how you were once just a dumb, I hate my dad faced teenager. Our family once needed to take a trip to the desert when Dunyazad was just a baby. Along the way, we were attacked by bandits. They had superior numbers and quickly overpowered our bodyguards. When all seemed lost, a group of passerby Aramites lent us their support. Okay. <gasps> Wait, Shazam man is her dad? Dude, no. Wait, how? That doesn't make sense. I, biologically speaking, if you know what I'm trying to say. Those Aramites were Kusela's brigade, Dekan al Ahmar. He is her mother! Kusela's men told me that the attackers were Aramite mercenaries, just like themselves. I was shocked. Why would Dukan al Ahmar go so far to save us and not spare the fellow Aramites? Okay. Kusela was grinning and walked over to play with baby Dunyazad. She was startled by his unfamiliar face and nearly started crying. <laughs> I guess he looked like really roughed up because he was just like in the desert really? fighting. I. And never knew. For like a big ass beard and said. He said that he had no particular reason to help us. He just took pity on us because he had a daughter about the same age. We started talking about our children and I sensed that he was a devoted father. Uh huh. To repay his kindness, I hired his brigade to help out at our estate for a time and offered everyone generous remuneration. So that's what happened. <sighs> It was many years before I saw him again. I almost didn't recognize him the next time he came knocking on my door. Hello, Dad. The man I knew to be strong and healthy had been reduced to a, a shell of Wait, a, was he sick? himself. He couldn't even walk anymore without his cane. Or old. Is he old or sick? So what happened to him? He was perfectly fine when I left the brigade. I'm not Old. too sure myself. The only thing that didn't change was his cheery disposition. He said there was absolutely nothing to worry about and that he had gotten into a fight. That was all. He then suddenly asked me if Dunyarzad, now that she had grown, would need a bodyguard of her own. At the time, 
Dunyazad was going through a particularly severe bout of her Elazar. Mm -hmm. There was no need her for her to have a bodyguard when she could barely leave the house. That she, she she was very sick for like I think all her life almost pretty much. So she she couldn't really leave the house. So there wasn't really need for a bodyguard because her her sickness literally makes her barely get out of bed. But he kept coming back to the topic. Come on, it, it never hurts to be safe. How do you know a bodyguard won't come in handy one day? He has a point. I was completely lost at first. Until he recommended the Blazing Beasts. And in particular, a mercenary named Dia. So he was the one who recommended Dia to you. Indeed. He didn't say it out loud. But it was clear that he saw Deshret's relics as an evil group who would eventually corrupt mm -hmm. every member in their ranks. He was already beyond redemption, but... Happy he sub he baby to detach his daughter Thank from the you. vicious world of mercenary life. Thank you for the sub baby. Yeet. If Dia could stay in my house and keep working as a bodyguard, then gradually her affinity for the desert would decrease and she'd be able to leave her previous life behind. Dad just wanted her to not be part of the bad mercenary. That's actually so wholesome. I told you from the start, Dad was not bad. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? I told you from the start, the way Dea explains everything, he don't seem like a bad guy. She just seems to be edgy teenager. And that's why you offered her such generous compensation? Yes. I Not told just you! Of that. Yes! From the moment that he asked me for that favor, I also began to see Dia as my own daughter. And that's also why I tried to persuade you to stay when you asked for permission to leave. I was willing to spend however much it took. Papa Shazam man. Kusela saved my daughter and I all those years ago in the desert. I could never refuse him entrusting his daughter to me. But like, is Kusela dead now? Is Dea's dad dead? Or is he just missing? I guess we'll <sighs> see some. always like that. Acting like he's oh so smart and self -righteous. Oh my god, Dea, stop! Kusela said that he'd reimburse me for a portion of Dia's fees. I refused to take any mora from him, but he Let's always go. sent me funds anyway. Eventually, I just accepted them as a token of his gratitude. And that went on for a while until I received another letter from him a few years ago. Oh, that's where he died. The letter contained a request to help him by... Food, oh. weapons, medicine, and even explosive materials. Uh? Wait, isn't that around the time that Takana Akbar started becoming more aggressive? That's right. When I started to hear some nasty rumors, I became wary. I wanted to meet him face to face to discuss things. But by then, he was no longer receptive to my requests to talk. If I had to guess... It's probably because he doesn't want to put Dia at risk. Okay. Fair. That thought I guess. occurred to me as well. I figured that he probably came to me uh, for help because he had nobody else to turn to. He probably has more connections than just you, I'll be honest. I, you underestimate the connections a man needs to survive in such a harsh climate, dude. Climate as in not the desert, climate as in the mercenary business, right? Like, like, like that whole lifestyle relies on connections, pretty much. After some deliberation, I decided to send him some food and medicine. I turned down all his requests for explosives and weaponry. Yeah, that one is indeed weird. The explosives and weapons? Weird. The medicine and food? I could have seen from a mile away. I am aware Let's go that five even months such of a the beautiful gesture Lily. of support could lead to others coming to harm, but... I could not simply reject his plea for help. In the end, it probably was the wrong decision. I plugged my ears to the rumors and just chose a solution that made me feel least guilty about myself. Uh, if you can, please tell me where he is now. Dead. None of the things he's doing right now make any sense if he's just trying to keep me from getting tangled up in his world. If all he wants to do is steer clear of me, then... Maybe he shouldn't have brought me into this world in the first place. Daya, I swear to God, he... I, she... Is she even listening? I, she's not... Chill! 
Uh, he cl she is so extra. Oh my, I cannot move her attitude. She is so edgy. Like, uh, if he wants to stay clear of me, he clearly he doesn't. Fuck, he wants a better life for you than he had in the Hi. fucking desert in this toxic ass survival of the fittest. Uh, dog eats dog environment. Fuck, dear. Oh no. Yeah, please don't. Thank you, Paimon. <sighs> I'm just angry because I can't wrap my head around any of his actions. How is it so hard to understand? Desert mercenary life as a fancy bodyguard in the city life? Pretty not so as. Survival of the fittest in the fucking desert? Just be bodyguard for rich people until retirement in the city. I don't see what the fuck. It's the hurt of. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't think I can do it. But I guess you do have a point. We haven't uncovered the whole truth yet. Fair. We still need to figure out his exact actions and reasoning for these last few years. Like, the only fishy thing so far is that he asks for weapons and explosives. That's, that's literally the only red flag. I'll do my best to help. Of course, anything between the two of you would need to be resolved between you and him. Alone. I don't know Kusela's exact whereabouts. Outside of supplying his brigade with some goods, I, I tried my best to avoid getting involved any further with him. However, there's a man on the list named Jawed. Jawed. He used to be a mercenary in the desert and is now a member of the Corps of Thirty. He's responsible for supplying weapons and liaising with the Dakan al Akmar's merchant okay. caravan. I think he should know Kusela's whereabouts. I've heard. That he likes to have a few drinks alone and enjoy the cool wind at night outside the tavern. Maybe you'll be able to find him there. What tavern? Understood. Thank you, sir. Then I guess this is bye for now. Unless... Unless... I'll stay and be with my father here. To be honest, I'm still a little dazed and haven't finished processing everything quite what yet. What does she have to process? My father has indeed done something wrong, but if I think about it... I'm also not sure if there was a right way to handle this problem. Okay, to enlighten me, what was wrong about what her father did? Did I understand wrong? Long story short, father got saved by Dea's father. And, uh, just, just because he saw a child, right? He sent supplies to criminals? I mean, he's been getting supplies and money and shit all the time, like... He was just helping out a friend for all he knows. For, for all he knows, they weren't criminals. I, I don't I don't know, man. I, <laughs> he hasn't really been funding a gang. He's just been funding some food and medicine for a sick friend. All is all I'm getting from this. I feel like her only course of action is to turn everything we know over to the core of 30. Maybe the weapons? And let them render judgment. Well, that's the thing. He didn't send explosives and weapons. He refused, which I understand, because that's the only weird part about the request. But for all I know is the dad has supplied money and goods the entire time for Dea behind the backs. And eventually it turned into him asking for... M uh, food and medicine instead, probably because Olsh and shit. Jill, thank you for the yes. two gift there. I am prepared to accept whatever verdict they choose. It's time to face my mistakes. Yeah. Uh. Is this the tavern I'm supposed to... Okay, but it has to be night time. This is night time. She is C4! I didn't- I didn't get any more yet. She is- she is C4. Yeah, I don't quite understand what he did wrong. I- I get the he supplied criminals, but... He pretty much just helped out a friend, to be honest. I, I mean, in one way or another, he quite literally just helped out a person that a couple of years ago saved him and his daughter from fucking death, most likely. Who has then spent years supporting the daughter and him. 
and then eventually just ask for food and supplies. Amongst explosives and weapons, which she then never sends. So I don't understand why the wrongdoing is if he re refused the weapons and warfare requests and only send food and medicine instead. I don't, I don't, I don't get it. Uh, is that him? Is that what? Yes. Huh? Who are you guys? I know what you've been up to. Smuggling weapons to violent brigades in the desert while working for the Corps. <laughs> Pretty bold if you ask me. Okay, damn. That's 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 a conversation opener that's uh <laughs> that's a way to break the ice. Fuck, man. I Jesus, give me a, a hot second. I wanna check something real quick. Mm. Nope. T Twitch drop still not there. Why? It says here it's enabled. Started two days ago, is going to end in two more weeks or so. Still no drops. Uh, nothing changed. When I refresh, still no drops. I'm getting them. Yeah, people claim that they get them. But... I don't get the tag. Which also lacks advertisement then. They have been wilding recently. Wait, have there been more people with the problem? Shh. Keep your voice down. How do you know all that? Come with me. We should take this elsewhere. I'll be happy to talk things over once we're somewhere private. Yeah, you should probably not discuss this at an open bar. Why not drops? No, this, this thing is. Do. All right. Back to my From question. a legal view, he would be liable for raiding and abetting a criminal enterprise. Mm. Legally, the fact he gave anything is the issue regardless of his intentions. I guess that makes sense. I get that. Morally, he did nothing wrong. Legally, I guess, well, his friend was also friend slash criminal, so helping them of anything, I suppose, is bad. But, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, all right, back to my question. How did you all know about it? Don't worry about that for now. You know what kind of punishment you'll face once we report you to the core, I assume. Wait, 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 there's no need to jump the gun. Let's talk this out. What are your terms? So what's in it for you anyway, Mora? Uh, well, I was a little tight on money at the time, and Kusela took good care of me in the past. See, he's a good dad! I waited in my mind, and I couldn't find a reason to turn the opportunity down. I wouldn't only be helping my benefactor, but I could also make some quick mora. Let me tell you how it is. We're investigating Dakan al Akmar, and we're gonna put an end to their operations. If you provide some help for us, then we might just put in a good word later to reduce the terms of your punishment. Hey, uh -huh. why don't we discuss this a little first? Listen, I made quite a bit of mora from my last run. And just give me a number, and I'm sure we can... Uh, shut it. Uh, my patience is running out. You should know when a mercen... All right, all right, oh, sheesh. But you gotta promise you'll put in some nice words for me later. They're always on the move. Here's the spot they were at the last time I made my delivery to the desert. Feel free to go have a look. I'm just telling you, though, it's not on me if they're not there anymore. Sure. And then you can forget about any nice words from us. Hey, come on. Now you're just being unreasonable. Really? And how do I know you're not leading us straight into a trap? Don't forget, you're the one with no bargaining chips. All right, I get it, I get it. Why don't you go take a look, and if they're not there anymore, I'll try to figure out something else for you. <laughs> his mustache, I can't. <laughs> Gosh, his mustache. <laughs> now that's more like it. Let's move. And as for you... Try to stick around the city until we get back. You don't want us to call the folks from the core and have them drag you back to the city. Friendly reminder that you got a meeting soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At, at 10, I know, I know. But he is so sad, no! He's a gassy girl. He's a, he's a little gassy. He's so sad, look at him! <laughs> what the fuck?
I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. The, the, the trap, she had a point with the trap. Stay I close. don't agree. I didn't question that. On your own. The desert doesn't take prisoners. I, I never questioned her questioning him. And yeah, the, the trap is cool. Hmm. Seems like we're in luck. That should be their camp right up ahead. Let's go. We'll finally get to the bottom of this ourselves. Let's go! I'm here to see Kusela. Tell him to get out oh. here. Boink. Tia. Boink. Why are you here? Boink. 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 I don't have energy. Okay. Think you can get away? Here we go. Everybody, stand back. Huh. Haven't you all done enough? Where's the rest? Oh, so are you also here to stop us? Stay out of this. It's got nothing to do with you. Get your ass here. Psh. Psh. Buckle up. Ha. You asked for it. Boink, 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 boink. Uh, where's the rest here? Psh. Here we go. Boink. Yeah. Oh, still alive! <laughs> One more smack. No, oh, she she's so strong. She she she. Uh, I did not defeat this many people. That that's that's a few too many people. Enough fighting. We all know each other, and I don't want to take things too far. Just bring Kusela to me. There's no use hiding him anymore. Uh. Did you understand a single word I just said? <laughs> or do I need to bash your skull in some more? All right, everyone. Let's all just calm down for a second. Um, Dia. The boss can't come out and see you anymore. Because he is dead! He died. A long time ago. I knew it! What? Seems like you've been out of the loop for a while. Guess that's for the best, though. At least, that's what the old man wanted. When did he die? What happened to him? A few years ago, Kusela broke up Dakano Ahmar and went to the Deshret's Relic's headquarters by himself. Oh. So is that when you guys started acting up? We would prefer to call it taking revenge. Every last person in Deshret's Relic's must pay in blood for what they Love did. You. Wow, Queen Shiny Roll Shiny Roll. Thank you, Kappa. Put us up, baby. <sighs> Let me start from the beginning. Dia. Do you know how the head of the relics maintained order internally? No. Overwhelming strength and unquestionable authority? Oh. Those were a part of it, yes. But just those on their own weren't enough. They had another tool at their disposal. They called it a person's record. Uh-huh. Regardless of whether they joined by their own will or were coerced, every person in Deshret's relics were forced to leave a record of themselves at headquarters. Okay, what record? Whether it be their deepest sin, some unforgivable act, or their most immoral exploit. The record served both as a symbol of loyalty and the perfect material for blackmail. Oh. That's Makes precisely sense. it. Every one of us have a record. Me, Bashar, Tikridi, and all the boys who grew up with Dia and ended up joining our ranks. But you, Dia, you were never asked to provide a record, were you? Uh, I... I hey never you. even knew this was a requirement. Hey yo. You were probably the only person in all of Deshret's relics who didn't know about it. Ever since you were born, Boss had been trying to shield you from this organization's sinister rules. Not only that, but he also banned all of us from committing any nefarious acts. He said he'd take care of the dues we had to pay regularly to headquarters. Okay. But in the end, he was just an ordinary person. What could he do? He was forced to go to headquarters again and again to account for missed dues and incomplete records. He'd come up with all kinds of excuses and get beaten uh. up as a result. We all knew he was doing that for you. He wanted to get you out of this world, no matter what it took. I told you from the start, Dad was good. Dea's just edgy teenage daughter. And that's why he became a shell of himself and couldn't walk without a cane. Because he's been taking beatings for a living. Wait, but... Doesn't make any sense. I didn't know about any of this, and I'd never seen him get injured or beaten. Because you were too young at the time, 
How would you ever tell between wounds from a beating and wounds from battle? Yes. When you left home after that final argument with him, he seemed to age by a decade overnight. Even his hair went gray. Oh. So even the blazing beasts were... Yep. It was all his doing. Had he not arranged them to come to you, you probably would have been reduced to a pulp before you ever left the desert. A few years ago, Boss said he needed to make another trip to headquarters. He was already pretty weak then, and we all assumed he was going to get beaten again. Makes sense. I suggested that he hand the role of leadership over to me, but he said there was no longer any need, since uh -huh. the Khan al-Ahmar would soon be no more. His words made no sense to me. But that night, we heard that a massive fire tore through headquarters and raised uh. everyone's records to ash. Well, no more blackmailing anyone. Everyone gained their freedom that night. Many members fled, not just from our ranks, but from the other brigades as well. Arson. Pyro Dad. We leave with a clear conscience. All of us who knew exactly what had happened. The boss can't have just died for nothing. Those heartless jerks at headquarters took him from us. Wump wump. From that point on, what the happened? sole purpose of Dakan al Ahmar became revenge. The big fire that boss started was quite a blow to headquarters. Wump strength. wump everybody. It's given us shy the opportunity shy to launch our shy Thank rave. you. Even though we're outnumbered, six months we strong vowed shy, to see our revenge go. through to the very end. Mm. There were people from headquarters who changed their names and went into hiding. Some fled to other brigades, and others escaped to the rainforest. What's in the rainforest? But we won't let any of them escape our wrath. They'll all pay for what they've done. Listen, I know they're from the headquarters, but like, I'm pretty sure some of those are innocent. They just did their job, dude. I'm pretty sure only the higher ranks are actually corrupt. I'm pretty sure the ones that that just wanna wanna go places are not. That's kind of weird. Your partner manager required. Oh shit, let me see. Womp womp. Womp womp! Alright, um... Yeah, I'll, I'll have to, I guess, uh, figure those out after stream. So, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll I'll get my jobs back eventually, I hope. And it's gonna boost our algorithm again eventually, I hope. <laughs> we'll see what we can do with the drops. Alright. My partner manager said that I have to get a ticket and then they'll try and resolve the problem. It's probably just a technical issue connected to my account. We've suffered plenty of losses as well. To keep going, we need an enormous amount of supplies. From food, and medicine, <gasps> they... to weaponry and explosives. They ask for the supplies. Food, medicine, weapons, explosives. It was never the dad. They just kept the, the line open. The supply line. It was never him. Oh, shit. Yeah, okay, so. Uh, quick explanation. Super quick, because I'm invested in the story. We do have drops, but when a stream has drops, the stream is tagged with a tag, a category tag, not a tag that you put in yourself, but a category tag, which also boosts the algorithm because when people are opening Genshin, there's going to be a ton of people that will only want to watch Genshin streams that have drops enabled. This sponsor today relies on drops to be there. This sponsor counted on the fact that drops are available it was part of the advertisement because it will boost the numbers and exposure to the stream because drops is a huge boost to viewership numbers and algorithm not having drops is it's yeah people still get drops but i only advertise to my community that's already there not the entirety of genshin you know so i don't i don't get any like increased viewer numbers or or boost out of this and the sponsor is also unhappy because they are relying on the fact that there's drops and that Twitch puts me into the drop algorithm, which it doesn't. So uh, that sucks for, Twi for Twitch and the sponsor and me. And it's just a lose-lose-lose situation for all three of us. 
So that's bad. I, I'm aware people still get drops, but I'm not tagged with the drops. My stream isn't officially tagged with drops. You can find my stream under the official drop uh, marker thingy. And the, yeah, that's why it's bad. That's why. All we can do is exchange our loot for Mora, and then use that to get supplies. We forged Boss's handwriting and sent out many letters See? to his former friends. Thankfully, many people were willing to come to our aid. We were also able to attract many mercenaries who shared our goal. We've endured unspeakable pain to win many impossible battles. Deshret's relics have become weaker and weaker, and now... We finally have an opportunity to directly strike their headquarters. Uh, Paimon doesn't know what to say anymore. Well, uh, <laughs> there's nothing to say. The situation is pretty much open, except that's kind of shitty that they finished it like that. <laughs> we do know right from wrong, but we were sinners from the very beginning. We do not deserve the freedom that the boss won for us with his life. Boss always loved his old-fashioned hero stories. Those tales about sacrificing yourself to save the world. Now you know why those stories are so important to him. Because that's literally his fucking life. We used to always laugh at him for it. But in the end, he really went and lived those stories out himself. Yes. As for me, I never considered myself a hero. We're all the lowest of the low. We have no right to even imagine such an existence. But maybe those hero stories he liked foreshadowed everything that was to come. The spirit of the hero touched all those he had saved, and more and more people joined his cause. I think Paro Dad just told those stories because in a way he wanted to tell them what he is up to, but he couldn't, so he made up stories that make it seem like he is just telling hero stories, but He's basically just telling his own stories of what he's been up to when others don't know better. Maybe we were all just acting along with the play in the beginning. But as we acted the parts and recited the lines, we were drawn in. And now, we want to see the story through to the end. I'm sorry, dear. I know you always found us insufferable ever since you were young. I'm sub nine. Just Think of this as a man. Thank you, my rub. I'll go with you. Huh? Dia? You wanna go with them? I grew up with these guys, and I know they're not bad people. It's just that some situations get so bad that it's difficult to tell good from evil. I I guess all I know is that Deshret's relics must be destroyed. I like how she is so easygoing with the mercenaries right here. She's like, um, mm, you're not really bad, not really good. I forgive you. But the dad who's been nothing but good. No, I forgive him. <laughs> Furthermore, I want to go see the place for myself. I want to know if my father is still there. I, they, uh, I, uh, <laughs> no. I know you don't want to get involved in this, hope. so there's no need for you to tag along. I can do this on my own. Yeah. Paimon feels like we'd only regret it if we don't see this through to the end. <sighs> yes. Thank you. We'll be a- <laughs> Ah, fuck! I bet Boss would lose his mind if he ever knew you'd join us at the very last moment like this. <laughs> yes, because that's what he tried to prevent! the injuries we sustain, we can't afford to turn down someone as powerful as you. I he don't can worry, think whatever I he wants. It. But the fact is, I owe him this much. Yes, I- uh. Do, I mean, do you? He really did not want you to do this. I, I, I don't know, man. I, Daya, I'm not sure you understand what he actually wanted from you. <laughs> if you think that that's how you repay him, I. This is this is really not what he wanted. I, I can guarantee you that. <laughs> You're dead, motherfucker. Hello, Lily. Seven oh, months please. of laughs. Love your streams. Thank Looking you, love you! Looking forward to a long, hilarious time. Yeah, that's the exact opposite of what he wanted. But sure, plot. <laughs> it's literally... <laughs> Daya, I don't... Everything she does is just to spite her dad. <laughs> Everything he has devoted his life for! 
Now she's like, hmm, my dad kept tried to keep me out of this and protect me and basically died for me. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna join you guys in finishing what my dad started. Which he only did for me to keep me out of it. <laughs> Daya. You sweet soul. Trouble on the way Let's here. go! Enter the cave. My dad wanted to keep me alive. <laughs> he he I hate him! Wow. Paimon didn't expect it to look like this on the inside. What did they should expect? all be holed up in here? Uh -huh. Don't know how many people they've got left though. Who cares? We'll round up all of them. Still, <laughs> we should be careful. Even if they've only got one shot left, it could still take us out. Yeah. We'll know what they're really capable of once we've landed some hits on them. Deshret's relics may have been a force to be reckoned with before, but their name means nothing now. Yeah. They don't stand a chance with you here. I'll take the lead. I've been here once before. Alright, let's go! Well, we got one shot. One opportunity. <laughs> To seize everything we've ever wanted. Hello! Illusion shadow. I'm going in. Time for takeoff. Pew. Let's play. Pew. Oh, they're mine. Okay, Venti doesn't quite break. There is no escape. Yeah. Also, they changed. The, the, uh. They gave me a different thing. Yeah. Illusion shattered. Inazuma shines eternal. Where's the rest? Back, 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 back. Oh goodness gracious! Teamwork is dreamwork. Think you can get away? Get your ass Brace over yourselves. here. There is no escape. Lots off. Boom. This way. Follow me. We're almost there. All right. Let's go. <laughs> I'm part of it. Grrr. They went charging ahead without checking for any tree. Hey, you guys okay? Oh wow, they didn't check <laughs> it for seems traps. Like we just now got trapped in here. Don't think we triggered anything else. Watch out, the enemy's coming from ahead. Well, now that things have come to this, it seems we'll have to fight our way through. Don't worry about us. We knew something like this could happen. Go and take a look around. There could still be another way through. Let's go! We can't let the boss down! <laughs> I like how clearly we can hear them. Let's just see if there's another way! The, big the sooner wall. we can make it through to help them, the better! Oh, is there another... <laughs> another way? On the... Side? Let's see. Wow, I, I wonder I what's over there. over there. But it's being blocked by something. Okay, let's go! Wow! <laughs> what the heck is this? Rays. Hmm? Lower? Change color? Oh, okay. We are just brute forcing it. I don't know how it works, but sure, I'll do. I don't understand what I was supposed to do, but uh, here we are. Let's play. Oh god, I hate that they changed my <laughs> team around. Illusion shattered, torn to oblivion. Oh, it's already dead. Damn. Another mechanism like the one before. I don't. But this one's being blocked off in the middle. Oh, uh, I think this we one. just need to adjust it a little. Rotate. Boom. Okay. And now, uh, we lower this one. Okay, cool. I I understand now. They have colored gems inside of them. 
What is this one for though? There's none here. Huh? Everybody doing? stand but There is no escape. Jesus, time for takeoff. Are they dead almost? Shine down. Another door has opened. Double it and give it to the next person. <laughs> Stop! There is no escape. Teamwork is dream work. Here we go. Think you can get away? Look alive. Hey, you're dead meat. That meat. They're already dead. Oh my god. How? <laughs> Oh goodness, what the, what, what in the world, Jesus. Oh, I understand, I think. There's one, and then we can raise this twice. That's two, kaboosh, kabam. This one goes here, we change color. And then this one goes here and we change color too. And then we change color again. I'm a puzzle genius. Big brain. I wasn't expecting anyone to make it through from the other side. But as Michelle? a desert dweller, I suppose we should be used to our folks defying all expectations. Who's Michelle? Don't waste your breath. You have nowhere to run. Run? <laughs> Had I wanted to run, I would have fled a thousand times already. <laughs> okay, Edgelord. I witnessed the golden age of Deshret's relics. I saw leader. I could leave this place behind. All oh, that awaits right me here. now are endless days of humiliation and ruin. Even now, my brothers and I still believe in one thing. The greatest should never live to remember their fall. Hat and shoulders. What? <laughs> so you want to go out in a blaze of glory? Let us draw our weapons. <laughs> We will show them <laughs> so the true edgy. power King Deshret bestowed upon his followers. They are but two, while we hold within ourselves the entirety of the relic's glory. <laughs> Atomics. <laughs> Wave one, charge! Eliminate them. Wave one. Oh no! Eliminate. <laughs> Time for takeoff. Venti. No! Buckle up! Don't think that you won. We're just getting started. Well, that is unfortunate. You are King Deshret will not abandon any one of his followers. Well, <laughs> about that. Let's get it on! <laughs> Brothers! With me. Oh, this is where we're hunting time. Y'all just wanna die? None of us plan to leave this place alive! Time for takeoff. But we'll meet again. That was it! That was his army! The commander has finally fallen. But they're still coming at us! This place is like gladiator's ring. They just keep coming no matter how many we beat! Yes! Keep fighting! Yes! There's no need to fear, <laughs> and no need to back down! This is Perhaps we should stand. call him Pizza Cutter, next wave pizza comes. because he is all edge and no point. Draw away their attacks? I'm going to see if I that high platform. Oh, and Zoe. I did trial Bandit in that same time. Wait, did- What? 
Come and face me, Michel. Are you guys enjoying uh, my so C6 banner? the front as well. Apologies, Lord Michel. They just Michel. They fight like absolute Lord Michel. Madmen. No matter how much we throw at them, they just keep coming for more. <laughs> Uh, oh no. I know where this is going. <gasps> then they're fast! So, it would seem like this is the end. Time to pay for everything you've done, Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> you think I would give you that opportunity? I will yeah, be buried choice. in the sand alongside all the rest of our fading glory. Go ahead. Enjoy. <laughs> hey, wait! I don't think he cares. You ain't the one to make demands. People run. Huh? We were too late. Eh? It's over. There's no more need to fight. But if you're still going to cling on to your so-called mercenary's pride, then I'll give you all a good beating as Wait, well. Wait, uh, did he pass out? What happened? Wait, I am chat. I'm so confused. How did that just happen? <laughs> hey, dear! I found the mechanism. I can just go back up here right away. <gasps> the elevator. Let's go. Okay. We just walking, S casually strolling, our Sunday stroll. Ah, uh, but but Okay, well, I'll, I'll, I'll go cross in the middle then, fuck. Ooh. What is this? Oh, it's the elevator. It's activated though, right? Yeah. He's so thin, he fell into the crack. Oh, Who I have to turn around. Rats? My bad. Why are you always <laughs> pestering us? Filthy rats, damn. I'm sorry, least chat, but you are clearly not welcome here, fuck. <laughs> you call yourself a member of the infamous Deshret's relics and you still can't even tell who's made it all the way to your headquarters? <laughs> Who knows what intent a bunch of rats may have? <laughs> we try to catch a couple and you all just show up <laughs> on the other side instead. How are we supposed to figure he out? He is what really after? after the rats, huh? Hey, have you ever heard of a man by the name of Kusela? <laughs> Why would I know? It's not like I'm in charge or anything. This is your last chance to talk. Hey, Edgy. I, I said I don't know anything. Edgy. I'm just an average member here. I'm telling the truth. If you're here to find someone, why don't you look through the records yourselves? Who can remember every name and face with so many people coming in and out every day? Oh no, sometimes there's music in cutscenes. It depends. The irony. His life became a light for so many, yet to others, it wasn't even worth remembering. Where's the records room? Answer me. It's right over there. All the files are in there. You can go through them as much as you want. It's not like any of them still matter anyway. I mean the old records room. People point. The, the old records room? You mean the one that got burned down? Kusela. Ah, yeah, I remember him now. The guy who could hardly walk. Yes? Watch your mouth. That's our boss you're talking about. He was definitely faking it. We all let our guard down as soon as we saw him come hobbling in. Huh? But in the short time it supposedly took him to take a dump, he'd already gotten away. He started a fire in the records room. <laughs> he, he did the pee pee poo poo. He took a duke duke. <laughs> he took a duke duke. He couldn't have possibly outrun us if he wasn't a fraud. And after that, Deshret's relics fell into complete disarray. He's a fucking genius. Stop wasting our time. It was a spicy Everyone of us here is perfectly aware of what he had done. Tell me, where is the old records room? It's just over there. Go see it for yourself if it means that much to you. There's nothing left in there but ashes. No human to show up. Oh, sorry. Let's go. We'll leave the others here to guard these guys. Spare them no mercy if they try anything. Hold up, I gotta... Hold up, I gotta take a dump, come into an arson. Alright! Just, uh, just a... Some casual... 
Ars Arson? Get it? Just me? No, sorry. I I guess. <laughs> Lily, <laughs> stop! So, this was his final destination. Mm -hmm. How did he do it? Getting past all the guards with a limp and sneaking in here to start a fire? Taco Bell. If he was nimble enough to do that, then he must have been able to get out of here after starting the fire, right? S stop. Dia. Dia, please. I'm sorry. I know it's just wishful thinking. Let's look around. Maybe we can find something that's been left behind. Is this a king? Must be the one that Dia's father oh, used. Oh no! Kusela. The king. Thanks for everything. And boss. now she carries. We're fortunate to somehow find that cane after that fire. Let's split up and look around some more. What if something else has been left behind? But what else could survive a fire like that? Huh? No, if he's still alive, I call bullshit. No. Okay. Hmm? Huh? Oh. Oh. Yo! The cane was a sword. Wait. Isn't that the toy sword you played with as a child? <sighs> The dragon is no more, for Princess Dia has slain it. Oh my it. god, she's so Its cute. head now and hangs so above edgy. the city gates. Her bravery has brought eternal peace and prosperity to us all. Dia, come on. This is the most important mine. Um, um, you can do it. But Dia, you defeated the dragon. Everyone's waiting for your speech. <laughs> <laughs> Still too shy, huh? All right, I'll do it. I hereby proclaim our victory. Evil shall plague us no more. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh my god. Is she f I hereby <laughs> proclaim our victory. Evil shall plague us no more, Dad. No! Oh, my heart! Fuck! No! <laughs> oh, fuck! You can't do this! What's this? Snuckies. Don't you remember? You asked Paimon what she would do if she were to wake up tomorrow with loads of money. And Paimon said that she would get boatloads of tasty snacks. Yeah. You looked super confused at the time, but said it was an adorable thing to say. These opportunities don't come by often. So today, Paimon's gonna treat you to a special crash course on Paimon's life philosophy. Hey, come on! Paimon's not that stingy. Oh, yes. Paimon anyway, is. the point is that you should eat to your heart's content. You'll feel better for sure once you've gotten something in your tummy. Tummy! Junior Zad will also be here shortly. She's Aww. already heard that we're back. Aw, thanks, you two. Honestly, this is very unlike me. I just had a lot on my mind on our way back, so I didn't know what to say. Oh, did you realize that your dad was never bad? Is my that it? My filled with all kinds of intense emotions. They just shook me even more than all the feelings we've shared during our previous adventures. But when everything came to an end, those emotions also vanished without a trace. And I was left feeling more empty than ever before. It was as if... I'd lost the thing that was most important to me. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> to many mercenaries, a Mora thing most, is the most important, important to you, the, the dad you've never loved us, until five minutes ago. Idrisi and the others all used to say that they would quit if there was no Mora to be had. But when it came to avenging my father, there was no Mora to be made anywhere. My reality shattered when I found out that the father who always told me hero stories was in fact a bad guy. But look at me now. Am I any different? Is 
she not understanding her own story? Uh, am I misunderst- How was he a bad guy? He literally tried to overthrow the mercenary system, so that wouldn't be- Am I misunderstanding the story? Wait, am, am I confusing? Her, her dad literally put an end- he, His whole goal was to put an end to like this whole blackmail mercenary system thing and- and Uh? He was with the bad mercs? I mean, yes, but he literally tried to like not have that happen anymore. The, his entire goal was to make things right. He, he ended up with bad people doing bad shit and realized that this ain't the way to go, so he... Oh, maybe it's a translation issue. Despite all my promises about never forgiving him and never trying to understand him, I still went to such lengths to find out the truth and nearly even shed tears for his sake. Yeah, his intentions were good. Meeting the moment, I'm almost done, I think. The story is pretty much done. I can't really end in the middle of it. Might have to delay by like five minutes or something. We're hypocrites. All of us. Be on time, shut the fuck up. Yeah, you're right. It's just a pity that we often only recognize our true feelings after it's already too late. <laughs> you're back! Are all of you alright? He was a murder for hire in the end. I mean, he was, but if I'm understanding the story right, his whole goal was that the people that were murdered for hire literally couldn't do otherwise because of the records. The records were used to blackmail them so they can't get out. Because if they wanted to get out, they were blackmailed back into the business by the record system that they had. So they could never stop. They are just cheap hire for murder, right? But the dad tried to set things right so that thing wouldn't be r ruled like that anymore. So they will no longer be stuck and by burning the records he has freed many many people. But it didn't overthrow the headquarters entirely, which are the people that ruled everything around there and blackmailed everything. So... They tried to finish off the job by uh, destroying the headquarter for good because now they were weakened, right? Yeah, he tried to change the system so they would be free. That's what I understood. Ah, there she is. Yeah. Many people from the core of 30 came over and I just wrapped up everything with my dad. All I can do now is wait for their verdict. Huh? Dia? You're looking yep. quite down again. Hi, Mama, explain. <laughs> that stare. A lot happened while we were gone. The <laughs> Dear stare. I'm sorry. I really should have controlled my emotions better. I just... I just... Yeah, I feel like Dia just can't get over the whole bad Merc thing at all. Even though the explanation as to why they just couldn't get out of being bad Mercs. Uh... It, it like like they had no choice. It it was it was survival of the fittest. They they wanted out. They wanted to be free. It's all right, my lady. You were hurt by all of this as well. Truth be told, I'm starting to feel a little guilty watching you cry like this. <laughs> but dear, now your pain must be even worse. You shouldn't need to comfort me. Hey, don't worry about me. If anything. This whole thing has finally shown me the difference between illusion and reality. My father probably thought that people could settle into new lives as long as they moved to a new environment. Mm. That thought has even crossed my mind a few times. It's like saying, what's wrong with adapting to a new life? Why is she upset though? I think she's just like a sympathy cry. She's upset on Dea's behalf. However, there was always something deep within my mind that refused to accept it. This impulse brought me great turmoil, and even made me feel ashamed for turning my back on your father's kindness. But now that I consider it again, it all makes sense. The desert sands are a part of who I am, and I will never be able to lead a peaceful existence. I understand how you feel. That doesn't mean I won't be making any changes to my life, though. As an example, I'm... Now thinking about taking on some small odd jobs. I good. What are small odd it's jobs? It's just like Idrisi said. 
I also want to catch up to my father and become a character in his play. Even if the ending of the story may be childish and ridiculous, it won't really matter. It's not childish to a literal child! It was a cute story! Isn't that neat, though? Oh, you'll be a whole new kind of mercenary, one that's not out for Mora. Why don't we go for a change of scenery once we finish eating? Uh, what about stopping by the Grand Bazaar again? Right. You said you wanted to get a rug for your family. I understood a rock, and I was like, a rock? <laughs> <laughs> what? A rock? I can't thank you enough for taking care of me this entire time. <laughs> you have this rock. This should be the end of the story. Oh, okay, never mind. We're going, we're actually going to the bazaar together first. Alright, understood. Cool, I guess. Sure. <laughs> it will be a fancy rock. Uh, how do I best go down? I, uh... Wouldn't gliding be faster? Venti, no, stop. I'm trying, okay? I don't I don't think it is in this case. I, it, it may be. I, I, I don't know. Do I have to go through this door here? Yes. Hi Lily, here's Hi. my womp womp tax for the rest of the year. <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> Appreciate it! <laughs> Let's go, Shania Line. Show me where to be! This rug here is quite something. The craftsmanship is exquisite. Very nice rock. Very and shiny. The fabric is also of high quality. Ah, here you are. Finally. Oh, finally. hello. Hey, uh, aren't you that mercenary who bit his tongue? You can still talk. Wait, are you here to take revenge on us? Oh my God, Paimon. <laughs> Please. What are you talking about? Do I look like I could take you all to a fight? <laughs> I just came here to give you something. I'll be on my way to give myself up to the core after this. <laughs> no way! Once I woke up, I hurried to the Khan al Ahmar's camp, hoping to alert them to your presence. <laughs> no way! But when I got there, I found no one except the members who were still too injured to move. <laughs> oh, I got top tier voice acting. Genshin, give this man a raise. Ah, so you probably got there after us. Yeah. They told me that they had exacted their revenge, and everyone had turned themselves into the authorities. Even that last camp was not going to last for much longer. I had joined the cause to repay an old favor from Kusela. Now that everyone's already turned themselves in, I might as well do the same. <laughs> this voice actor went all out, dude. Let's One go. One of the injured members gave this box to me. And told me that it contained some of the old man's last possessions. My man read the script and he was like, after I bit my tongue? What? And he knew what to do. Everything left in the camp will get confiscated. <laughs> so I figured I should get this to you before the court could get their hands the on assignment. It. Thank you. No worries. We are all just living our own truths. There's no need to comment or judge anyone for it. <laughs> so this box Lily, yeah. Lily, Lily, I finally got some blowhole huh. blast. Now yeah, to try it. Snort, snort, just kidding, I'm drinking it properly. Seriously though, well, you didn't exaggerate the, day, the flavor. The it's delicious. I told you! Things like drinks and meat. But let's see what's inside. Wh what's this? Uh, it's just a bunch of junk. Junk? It Ugh, it kinda stinks. Uh... Perhaps it's just been left unopened for too long. Hmm. I wanna a see! A copy of a storybook. The paper's already yellowed, and it looks like it's about to fall apart. <gasps> a storybook! <gasps> the dad stories! It was against the Academia's rules to possess books for personal use. <sighs> if he was Wampo. going to break that rule, Wampo. he could have at least copied something useful. Oh my god, Dea, stop. That Be grateful. That probably means this was really important. 
Yes, thank you, Paimon. I can't believe that Paimon is the one with the most sense in this fucking storyline. I d ah, Ugh. here are a few bags of children's snacks. The packaging's completely deteriorated. Maybe that's oh, where the smell was coming snackies. from. Snackies. Did he get those for you? Yeah, but here's the thing, though. Even when I was a child, I was never a fan of these kinds of snacks. He'd always say that he got them for me, but in the end, he always ate more than I ever did. Wow. What 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 a waste. The only things you can buy with the limited money he has, trying to make her happy and then snacking some as well when they're literally left to rot. God, can she not for two seconds? Like anyway. Isn't that just common sense? Daya, please. I, clearly he didn't mean for this box to not be open for 30 years. <sighs> Forget it. Let me see what else is in here. Mm, a razor, some buttons, some round iron tiles, a wooden toy puppet, a wool scarf, which from the looks of it probably belonged to a woman, and a hair clip? Mom? Uh, why are these things here? Uh, I, I, I'm uh, suddenly feeling a little scared. I'm sorry, my lady. But this is just the kind of man he was. He probably saw this box as some kind of personal trash heap and dumped any and everything oh in there. They, I cannot stand her right now. I, I'm a, this character development just does not sit right with me, I'm gonna be honest. One, no, two empty liquor bottles. <sighs> Tell me, you guys, are these the kinds of things that a normal person would leave behind? <sighs> There's Can't we just trade Paimon for a chibi lily or shiny or kashai <laughs> stare? Oh, you're right. <sighs> All right, I got it out. It seems to be a piece of paper with some writing on it. The bottom part's all damaged from moisture, though. Let's hope the writing didn't smudge. I was suddenly seized with an urge to write a letter after finishing this bottle. I just folded it up and left it in the bottle, though. If I end up forgetting about it, it won't really matter. To Dia. <gasps> it's a letter from Oh, me? no shit. The box is for you. Who would have guessed of all the candy and accessories and shit in there? Wow. It's all right. I'll just read it out. If he went to the trouble of writing a letter, there must have been some important things that he wanted to say. Oh, really? Or at least record down. My condition's becoming worse and worse. Can't even walk without a cane anymore. Much less go out and have fun. Yes, I don't have many days left. If you're reading this letter, then I suppose I'm already long gone. You were adorable as a baby. Everyone loved you. And regardless of whether you were crying or laughing, everyone enjoyed having you in the group. But once you grew a bit older, you were no longer nearly as happy or cute. It's probably Idrisi's fault. <laughs> he was never up to any good. <laughs> Can you believe this guy? He can point the finger at himself. Oh my god, Dea, no. I shut your food hole, I swear. Oh my god, Dea, no. I, I'm so over her. Anyway, back to the point. To summarize, I'm writing this so you would know not to feel sad for me, even if you end up finding out the truth. The reason being that... <laughs> I was never your father to begin with. Ah! Uh Wait, what? Surely, uh, he must be joking, right? What? I, I don't know. <laughs> uh, I was quite formidable when I was young, and a hundred times cooler than some so-called flame main. <laughs> really felt like the whole world was under my feet. With just a teeny tiny bit of effort, I felt I could rule over the entire desert. See, ha. Huh? Also known as the dumber Sasuke, I swear. I swear. <laughs> but as fate would have it, I went out into the desert for a drink one day and discovered a baby in the sand. She was just abandoned! Was, you were just lying there, small and helpless. You were so tiny that if the wind blew for just a little while longer, you would have been buried forever. But your cries sand were so baby. loud, they made my head hurt. <laughs> now that I think of it, you... Really were a bundle of energy. She was adopted. Uh, sounds like he's serious. I told Idrisi and the others that I had slipped up with a woman while out and about. <laughs> None of them even doubted me. <laughs> I'm sorry that I had to lie to them for so long, but I really had no other choice. 
I was their most esteemed leader, after all. I like I to just tell them that I suddenly wanted to play at being a father. I that's what I've been saying. It doesn't make sense that he would keep the child he had with a random woman as a slip up. That I told you it was fishy. Oh my god, I predicted the whole story. <laughs> ah, at this rate, I'll puke up all the liquor I just drank from this bottle. Shut so, up. Uh... <laughs> anyway, Dia, you possess the kind of freedom and kindness that we could only dream of. As far as how you should live your life, that'll be up to you to decide. That's the end of the letter. In the end, he was still thinking of me as a little child. Uh, uh, please don't make this into a bad thing. I suppose, or I would have suffocated under the sand a long time ago. He was a good father to you. Thank you, Dunya Zai. The fact that he wasn't a blood relative doesn't change that. Facts. Yeah. Oh my god. It's just a pity that we had to learn the truth of everything like this. Do you already have some ideas about the decision that he wanted you to make? I do. If he first found me alone in the sands, then I want to try my hand at finding the person who abandoned me. I just have one wish. To tell them a story. That there once existed a childish and foolish jerk with a heart of gold. Thank you! And that only under his care was I able to grow and mature into the person I am today. Gosh, I... If you Finally. end up finding any leads, can you share them with us? We go on adventures all the time. Maybe we'll be able to find some information for you. <sighs> sure, I appreciate it. I wasn't expecting you to be so enthusiastic. I'll help too. Thank you. All of you. Thank you so much. My life has certainly had its twists and turns, but I've always considered myself lucky. Oh, really? It didn't sound like that. Because no matter where I've gone, I've always been surrounded by incredible kindness. Gosh, that took forever. For that character development literally took until the last five minutes. Jesus! That... <laughs> Damn, that was something! I cannot believe I... Jeez. Fuck, man, that, that took so long. Small, thank you! Small Alwyn, what a gift that sub is. <laughs> thank you! Holy shit. Thank you. Yeah, 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 meeting time, I know. I've, I've finished. Yeah, yeah, meeting time, I know. I know, I know it's late. Okay, we are rating. Fine. I don't even get to say goodbye to you guys, man. I, 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 uh, the, the, the Daya's awful personality rub off on you? All these hours we spent today. And for what? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Shaking my head. <laughs> Be nice to Busca. <laughs> yes, and of course we do the rubies. Of course, of course. Shrubbies. I threw you around the bus this time? I don't give a Your shit. Patience, I don't give. <laughs> they understand, but meetings be like that sometimes. It ain't my fault. Shrubbies. Wait, Scott. It was really fun playing Gensum of you. Thank you so much for sponsoring the stream, Gensum! I uh, sponsored the. Uh, Sponsored uh, the pulls also. Uh, I'm very sorry that the drops. Well, they they worked, but uh, the, the algorithm for the drops did not. So that's well, kind of unfortunate for everyone involved. <laughs> so that sucks. Except for the viewers. I you guys don't care. You get the drops because you're here. But yeah, thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you for sponsoring Stan. Their story has been amazing. Even the character development took until the very last sentence. Damn. <laughs> I love you, Tzak. Goodbye. <laughs>